All right, is it up? It's up. It's good. Lo-fi is blasting. Really blast lo-fi. You can only like calmly relax and listen to lo-fi. What up, Carter? Forced, boast, first in the nation. All right, what are we doing? Oh yeah, I want a looting sword. I demand a looting sword is more like it. Three in a row, baby, let's go. For you, for you first three in a row, man, Chris has been slipping. I love it counts as first when you guys like. That's first, you know, when you get here and the stream starts, all right, that's first. You know, when, you, when you guys get here and it's like the stream hasn't started yet, it doesn't really seem like a fair and genuine way to call first. Sharpness, still not what I want. How many wigwams does it take to change a light bulb? I'm 99% sure I do not want to hear the end of this joke. Has anybody ever told a how many X does it take to change a light bulb joke and had it be funny? Could this be the time that changes it all? Probably not. Probs? No. If I had to guess. What do I have in my inventory? A bunch of garbage? Why would I leave all this garbage in my inventory, bro? I don't even know if I have room for all this stone. Why did I have two small stacks of stone? So much random crap filling in my inventory. End it. End what? End the stream? Okay. Just put it on hold, baby. Wow, as soon as I say that, it says YouTube is not receiving enough video to maintain smooth streaming. As such, viewers will experience buffering. It takes me on because there's only one wigwam. Alright. Well, didn't make me hate myself, so we'll take it. Chat, what am I going to do with all this iron? I got so much iron, I need to do something with it. I got a bunch of gold, too. I need to make a bunch of gold blocks. Look, YouTube, you're getting as much data as you're going to get, so I suggest you just suck it up and uh, go about your life. You know, quit giving me BS error messages, because quite frankly, nobody cares. Nobody cares the trouble you've seen. Nobody knows your sorrow. Quartz pillars. I need like a bunch more quartz. Bunches and bunches. Oodles and oodles of quartz. How's the stream working for you guys? It seems to be working fine. It looks fine to me. I have it pulled up and I'm monitoring it as, as one does if one wants to make sure one has a smooth streaming experience. And you know what? Quite frankly, I think it looks fine. I think it looks delightfully fine. If I do say so myself. Pow, pear, pear. Uh, let's take a stack of iron upstairs. Probably need some wood. That's what she said. Ooh, I love wigwam streams and a bunch of anime nerds come and don't shut up about video games. Whoa, man. Why do they gotta be anime nerds if they're talking about video games? Couldn't they just be video game nerds? Dang, bruh. Who pooped in your coffee today? It looks fine for me, good. I mean, as fine as YouTube's algorithm will ever let any stream look, or not algorithm, but compression. I watch Kane play this too, and I'm just, or like Isaac, and in this, honestly, I'm just reminded that like, YouTube butchers quality. I think I was blaming Restream, which is one of the reasons why I switched off of using it. Then I kind of realized it's not really Restream's fault, it's just YouTube sucks. YouTube's just bad at its job of streaming. I guess its job is technically to play videos, not live, but even then, it still sucks. YouTube just compresses the hell out of everything, which I guess I get it when you're, like, using that much video storage space. A lot of processing power you gotta, you gotta have out there. I have plenty of iron. I did not need to bring more iron up here. And I did, and I don't care. A bunch of junk in here. I don't really need to bring a bucket or a boat into the nether with me. Chat, why can't you make a steel boat and boat across lava? All right, think about that, all right? Works fine, we're good, good, good. See, this is why I never listen to YouTube, it's full of shit. Let me see, let me close Discord so that I can actually see this, yeah. Your stream quality is good. Yeah, Streamlabs OBS will be more truthful with me. 
Well, I mean, kind of had a good day. Didn't have a mental breakdown, so I considered it okay. Hey, baby. That's a good day to me. You <laughs> can get through the day without a mental breakdown. We'll take that as a win. We'll take those, baby. Alright, I need an iron pickaxe to go to the nether. We're gonna get some quartz and try to kill some stuff. Like some endermen. In an effort to... Uh, get some ender pearls and also level up. We need to level up more chat But you know we could always collect more stuff from the nether I guess I could go to another nether portal or fortress. I mean should go to another nether fortress You can soon but with a minecart. That'd be cool. Oh, is that part of that huge new update that's coming out? That's exciting nether biome seems like something they should have done five years ago, but you know better late than never We'll take it I guess a minecart makes sense. It would make sense if you'd have to build something special though. Like you should have to insulate it somehow, right? It should have to be like, you should have to take uh, what you do to make a boat, but then like use steel instead of wood and then uh, put like a piece of cloth in the middle, like cotton and call it like insulation, you know? Maybe one day I'll remember to like bring a uh, second door but probably not. I don't really come to the nether enough to justify it. Alright, I need quartz and glowstone, baby. And also, I will murder any endermen you might have uh, just floating around if those guys are hooting a boot today. Also, I'd like to be able to find my way home. Which direction have I not really explored? I don't think I've really gone like up and over this way. My nether portal actually kind of is in a crappy location, dude. It's like... Everywhere I go, it's like I can't get anywhere because I'm too high up. I think that's just kind of a general nether problem. I don't know that that's specific to our nether portal location as much as it is just an issue with the uh, underlying area as a whole. I love the lava waterfall, man. We should build our own lava waterfall. Tight. Twit, 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 twit. Oh, I can use diamond for quartz, iron for nether rack because the nether rack, I'm tired of glitching the nether rack. I'm tired of like mining the nether rack so quickly that it just glitches out kind of a pain in the buttocks all right and my buttocks don't need any extra pain that's what I got chat for ha boom roasted all right we'll put two torches there so I know I need to go up Carter's the most relatable guy here <laughs> I actually almost screamed in class because I got so much anxiety I almost died yeah <laughs> yeah relatable <laughs> who can relate it sounds like I'm belittling you but I promise I'm not I hated school dude my freshman year of college there was a week where I um I broke out in hives for like virtually no reason. Well, the reason was stress. No, no ender or no gas tier. Uh, I broke out in full hives, which has never in my life happened to me before or after that. This was like finals week ish. It was like right before finals week of freshman year and things were not going well for me. I was learning that laziness is not something you can get away with in college like you can in high school. Because in high school, if you're smart and good at doing homework last minute, which I will say are probably two separate skills. Like, like part of it's being smart, part of it just doing homework at last minute is like almost a skill in and of itself. But if you can pull that off, uh, you can just never do homework at home, work a job, and just sleep through most of your easy classes, and then the harder classes, you maybe stay awake sometimes. All right, and you get good grades and you graduate magna cum laude, which is what I did. Sounds like a brag because it is. But then I went to college and uh, oh, if you were not happy about the first part of that story, let me tell you about some uh, some great comeuppance that happened to the main character of that plot line. Uh, his dumbass went to college, learned what alcohol was, uh, dicked off a bunch because he assumed he could get away with it. Spoilers, no. <laughs> and, uh, you know, did really poorly a lot of time. Did really poorly. So anyways, it was like coming up to the end of the year. Grades were bad. Stress levels were high. Everything was not going great. And uh, I just woke up one day covered in hives. That was fun. That was really great. And then uh, like later that same week, I got strep throat so bad again for the first and only time in my life. Uh, that I coughed up blood and had to leave school for a week to go home and take antibiotics and die. You ever had strep throat so bad that you can't swallow, like, water? Cause I have. 
You ever coughed up blood? Cause I have. It's not fun. Zero out of ten. Would not recommend. Maybe one out of ten. No. Maybe like a point seven out of ten. I did get to miss a week of college, which was not great, honestly. I don't want to miss college. Luckily, I later like got my shit together, got smarter, and started applying myself. So I started, after I was an idiot and lost most of my scholarships, I started paying for school out of pocket to keep myself honest. And you know what? It was a system that worked for me. It really did. And I did that. I always got A's and B's only through all of my calculus and physics class. All the same high-level engineering classes that I was taking. But I started getting good grades because suddenly it was me working and paying for college instead of just like loans and like more abstract, you know, thoughts. And uh, it's amazing the mentality difference that putting your own money on the line will make. And then I dropped out of school entirely to do film and now I never get any film jobs because it's January and I just stream. And that has been my life up to this point. Chat, what's new with you guys? How's your entire life going? What's Hives? Who's the main character? I'm the main character. I'm always the main character. It was a story about me. Come on, Bison, follow along. God, I'm wasting my best material. I should have waited until more people got here. We got a new teacher, uh, so it's easy to sleep. I feel like the teachers were pretty 50-50 on whether or not they cared if I slept or not. Most of them in the end, you know, I was that kind of kid where like, in high school at least, it's like if I slept, it would be like, uh, got away. If I slipped in class, they would be like, they would try and give me like, oh yeah, Aaron, do you want to answer the question on the board? And then I would answer it and they would be like, all right, damn it. <laughs> Go back to sleep, you bastard. Like I said, high school was really easy for me, but college just requires work. College is the great leveling playing field, I feel like, one way or the other. Like, there's no need to be scared. I feel like college is all about the amount of effort that you put into it. So, if you, um, it doesn't really matter as much just your raw natural intelligence, I feel, honestly. I mean, sure, of course, to a point, uh, you're not gonna just, you're not just gonna hard work persevere your way through a nuclear physics degree if you're a total moron. But anybody could be successful in, to some degree, in some degree, aha, wordplay, in college by purely just putting forth the work and the effort involved in, um, and doing homework, writing essays, studying for tests. And on the flip side as well, if you're really smart and usually get by on that, you're gonna have a bad time because you gotta put in the effort in college. College demands effort and will not be satiated without it. Nobody breezes through college while napping through every, well, you can nap through every class, but you gotta do a lot of reading at home anyways. Honestly, most college classes are total trash and 90% of what you're doing will just be reading textbooks and doing homework Anyways, especially if you have anything semi-math related. All math related college courses are basically just read the book and do it at home. People like me now or whatever, like me now or whatnot sound good. Hell yeah, man. Good for you. You know, social skills are something you can learn too, though. If you're not, you don't think people like you or you don't make friends easily, it's definitely a skill you can learn. Case in point, my own life. Why do you want a looting sword? I need a looting slash unbreaking sword uh, so that I can get ender pearls so that I can get to the end so that we can fight the ender dragon and go to whatever the like the the even endier end is I don't know what it's called but the end city Lego city a man has fallen into the river in Lego city quick build the helicopter Could you imagine Bro, he's gonna be dead by the time you build a helicopter from scratch. You should have had that helicopter pre-assembled before he fell into the lake. River, whatever. I don't think it matters at this point. The point is a man is dying. And you are assembling a helicopter because you have procrastinated a life-saving service and wasted taxpayer funds on nothing. Four ender elderman to kill ender dragon. Yep. That is what we're looking for. Also, the fire sword... Well, kind of cool, not extremely helpful, quite frankly, so kind of got to replace it, Doug. Wow, this uh, iron pickaxe did not last as long as I kind of hoped it would. Maybe is UI. Wow, what? Chat, 
Chat, do you like the lo-fi? Because I'm going to keep listening to it regardless, but I'm interested to know if you do or not. It's not going anywhere. You don't, you don't retain that kind of power here, chat. I mean, I guess technically you do. It actually probably is going somewhere. So I finally qualified for YouTube Partner, but also we have to go through a small review process first. Which is kind of dumb, because it's like, come on, man, I've already put in so much effort. Hey, another fortress! That's neat. We like those, right? Work some torches here. I didn't really bring enough torches to explore another fortress, because that was not my plan. But, uh... Fudge, we'll do it anyways. I think me and Bison just had a bondage moment. Uh, I don't think that means what you think it means. Bonding and bondage are not interchangeable. One typically requires a uh, safe word. Oh, I definitely don't have enough torches. Well, I'll never find my way back here if I go now, so I might as well just explore this another fortress. Funny if this was just like, oh god, oh god, ow, okay, and ow, okay, 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 ow, jerk, stop, you're being very dramatic right now, I stopped being on fire, thank you, this is nether fortress even going dude, this is tiny, this better just be like the wing of like a much grander nether fortress, the nether bricks are so dark that they, like, once you put them through YouTube compression, I know they just look like garbage on your end. That's, like, the rough part, right? It's, like, I can actually see fairly well in the nether pretty much at all times. For being totally honest. It's, like, I don't feel compelled. I've already been here before! God dang it! <laughs> well, that was disappointing. Yeah, I can get all that glowstone at least. It's about to be so psyched! Oh well. Oh well, chat. Chat, what, what streams, what are your favorite streams, chat? How you liking streams so far? There's only one other person here. Carter, how are you liking streams recently? I've been really enjoying playing Isaac again. My Isaac addiction is going full tilt again. I play Isaac, I watch other people play Isaac. I am like, I haven't been this addicted to the Binding of Isaac since I like first got into it. Why do I have torches all over this already? I must have like had a full inventory here. I bet you had a full inventory, but I bet you secretly I could have just put all the glowstone dust together into solid blocks and then I wouldn't have had a full inventory and I probably could have taken this already. But that's a story for another time. That gas was a Karen if I've ever seen one. I think all gas on some level are kind of Karens, you know? I think they all kind of just display those principles of Karenality. I remember my last message was 420, I like it, nice. Nice. 420 messages, nice. Maybe I should just kill every pigment in the, the nether. Maybe that would give me enough, uh, enough experience points to, uh, Get what I need to get here. I wonder if there's any tips for getting a looting sword. Maybe I should look that up. Maybe there's like some way I could kind of cheese the process a little bit. Three Sea of Thieves is better. I'm not gonna play Sea of Thieves. Look, you want me to play Sea of Thieves? You can buy it for me. Cause I got no money. I'm starting to work a little bit thanks to Task Rabbit, which is nice. And I do potentially have a really exciting film job next weekend. But we're not really sure if it's happening or not. It's a guy I've worked for before. He's a real legit, like, producer. He produces music videos for, like, bands you guys have heard of. Do you know who Motionless and White is? Because I got to work on one of their music videos, if you know who they are. I didn't really know who they were, but I kind of dig them. They're not really my style of music, but I still like them, you know? I could, you know... I could listen to them. I wouldn't listen to them a lot on my own. They remind me like if AFI was like a lot more hardcore. Like if AFI was like more of like a metal band instead of an emo band. Oh, they're pretty good. I dig it. I dig it, chat. But I, you know, I dig most music if we're being totally fair. And I'm really not that picky about music anymore. I feel like I can find redeeming qualities in most 
music. Oh god, oh god, oh god! That was not the... This is bad. <laughs> I hate how, like, lava can just spread down. And just, like, keep getting bigger and bigger. Am I, like, ever gonna not be on fire? How do I get out of here? Like, that was, like, one tiny little block of flow, and then the way it opened up made it huge. Wow, that almost sucked. Like, look, look at it. Look how large it got. That's what she said. <laughs> I love Motionless and White. What was the song? Uh, whatever their latest music video was, I worked on that. I worked on that music video. That's cool. I finally get to talk about something that I worked on that you know about, chat. And it's not a shitty Lifetime movie. Oh my god, chat. I'll probably tell this again later, Carter, because it's worth telling to more people. But, uh, so, we did this movie, and there's this really, this actress I did not like. She's your quintessential stuck-up, uh, I need all this special treatment kind of actor. And she was like, I don't know, she was nice enough, but I could not stand her spoiled attitude, dude. Uh, so the movie comes out on Lifetime and people are just roasting this girl's eyebrows. I felt so bad for her, dude. They're like, they called her like caterpillar eyebrows and like that was like, there were more comments about her eyebrows than the rest of the entire movie. <laughs> it was so bad. Hey, what's up, no name? I haven't watched your streams in a long time. I know, man. It's been a while since I've seen your lack of a name popping up in the chat feed, dude. How's it going? How are you been? Uh, I forget the name of the song. I can look it up real quick. It's Motionless in White. Uh, Another Life. I worked on this music video. Oh, it's got 4 million views. That's cool. Yeah, so I'm supposed to be working with this music producer again as a second AD. But I don't know if it's happening or not. It just did a video for Faded Glory. Uh, a lot of my friends worked on it. But unfortunately, they only hired one PA and it was not me. And I don't think they had a second AD on it either. They just had an AD and a 1PA. I have a, a good friend of mine is like always the go-to PA for Scott. He's been working with him for a long time. So it's like, you know, it's whatever. Can't really be upset that I don't get those calls. Because I always get the second call because I'm always Craig's first recommendation. And I think Scott liked working with me the one time I did. Indeed called it. They're getting bigger. I think by 2020 they will be huge. Nice. I mean, they're already pretty big by like a long time. I mean, a month. I mean, a month's a, that's a while to go without watching a stream. I've been streaming a lot in the last month. I think, yeah, they're pretty good though. I, I like them. That song is getting big. Dude, it's super exciting. I liked it a lot. Like I, when I first listened to it, I, I'd never really even heard of them before the music video shoot. And when I first got there and heard that song, I was like, all right, you know, this is kind of something I could dig. Like, it wasn't, like, immediately, like, oh, this is this is my kind of music. But I was like, you know, it kind of grew on me as the day went on. Uh-oh, chat. I'm gonna get lost again. Yeah, I was in this ravine, wasn't I? Wasn't I, like, walking around down low in this ravine for a long time? Dang it. Where are my torches? Why do I always do this to myself? Okay, wait. Just look around, bro. Where are torches? Shoot, <laughs> there's no torches. There's no torches at all. This is the way I went. All right, yeah, so I was coming this way. All right, and this way. I really gotta do a better job of leaving trails for myself. Did you meet the band? Yeah, I met the whole band. Super, super nice guys, honestly. Wait, was I. Wait, was I going this direction or did I start going this direction because I wasn't paying attention to where I was going? Lava, not a torch. There's a torch. Okay. I guess I don't really need to go back. I just need to find a new direction to explore. I'd love to get down there, I guess. And I'd also like to get to some glowstone. It's hard to get to glowstone that like isn't so precariously perched. Don't fall in the river in Lego City. Yeah, because they haven't pre-built the helicopter, man. The helicopter should be pre-assembled. Can't just wait for there to be an emergency and then build the helicopter. That's poor risk management. 
go down there and get more magma blocks, but I don't really need more magma blocks. Ooh, but there's some glowstone. Ooh, and there's a giant ocean of lava. Not gonna get that glowstone. Yep, it's gonna be a while till we get that nether rat update, and sadly. You lucky bastard, I didn't mean it like that, sorry. The album was my third one I've ever bought. Nice. I didn't mean it like that. Well, I didn't I didn't take it in a negative way. I mean that, that seemed like a generally positive statement. I got what you were going for, man. No need to apologize. I mean be jealous. Your jealousy feeds me. It's like 99% of the reason why I got into the film and video production business. I'm just kidding. But I'd be lying if I said it was a cool like I feel like you're supposed to pretend like you don't care that you get to meet famous people. And you're supposed to act like it's not cool, but I do care, and it is cool. <laughs> like, let's be honest, it's pretty damn cool. All right, let's 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 just be totally honest. All right, it makes people jealous, and we get off on that. Everybody who you ever meet who works in the film industry will probably lie to you and be like, oh, you know, it's just whatever, you know, they're just like, they're just like normal people like you and me, you know, it's just, it's just, you know, it's not really that big of a deal after you start to meet a couple of them. But that's a lie because we go on set and the first thing we do is we compare who we've worked with, what are the biggest name stars you've worked with. Everybody loves to name drop stories, dude. Oh, well, I was working on a movie with Shia LaBeouf. And you know, did you know that Shia LaBeouf likes egg salad sandwiches? And we would have them on Crafty all the time because that's just what Shia wanted to eat. Like, that's a little bit over the top, but I mean, genuinely, if I'm being honest with you, that is kind of what it's like to work in film. They don't mention, like, I was too scared to talk to Shia LaBeouf, so we never exchanged a single word despite working with each other for three months. Because that also happens. He was terrifying to be around, and I uh, did not talk to him at all. <laughs> Some people are like that. Sometimes, honestly, you do work with celebrities, and it's like they are... They're, they're assholes and they're intimidating because they are assholes and you don't like them and you know You're just like I can't wait to not be around you so I can talk about you know other people in the business And I can tell you if you ever know anybody that works in the film industry the stories they tell you are so Bullshit sugarcoated compared to the stories they tell each other when we tell stories to people that aren't in the industry It's all about like yeah, I met uh, I met Will Forte and he was so nice and lovely and we we had a nice Conversation at the lunch line and sat down and had lunch together uh, And it was it was such a grand experience and I I traveled and I got to meet other people and that same story when I go to my industry friends is like Dude, I worked the worst job of my life and I wanted to die every second like I worked in 18 inches of blistering cold snow and I lost a toe and I met uh, I met William Shatner and he was the biggest asshole ever and I like, wanted to punch him in his big dumb face Um liar Don't Burn me when there's an invisible block here you fucking liar Who is Shia LaBeouf? Shia LaBeouf famous Hollywood actor uh, he was in Even Stevens, he was in Holes, he was in Peanut Butter Falcon, he was in Honey Boy, he was in Transformers. He's, I don't know, he's Shia LaBeouf. How do you not know who Shia LaBeouf is? He's the, he's the do it meme guy? Do it! Just do it! He's that guy. He's the meme guy. He used to be on TV shows when I was a kid, but now he's just kind of a meme guy. If we're being honest. So I'd rather have another stack of magma blocks over netherrack. Actually, I don't know that that's true. I don't really, uh, you need magma blocks for anything, but I could use more of this. Voices was first middle song I enjoyed and now I'm crazy. Nice. <laughs> Never bought an album because I've never listened to music. That's true, you only listen to Eminem. I'm getting tired. I need to construct my bed soon. Fair enough, man. What time is it where you are? It's like 4.30 here. I'm gonna assume you must be in Europe. I've heard Chris Motionless is an awesome guy. All the people in Motionless and White were incredibly nice all day and incredibly hardworking. It was really cool because we got to a point in the day where they were done for the day and they... 
were all finished filming their band parts and then we just had to do like the music video parts after that and um they just like stuck around voluntarily and hung out which like sometimes can be a huge pain in the ass with actors on set but uh for bands and music videos not really the case typically it was really cool that they cared enough about their video and their music and everything that like you know they wanted to just stick around and watch how the guy did and they were super cool you know they didn't interfere they weren't trying to direct it they weren't stepping on anybody's toes they weren't telling people how to do their jobs they were like they were just there because they wanted to be there which i thought was just super cool those guys dude yeah, it's 4 35 in new york yeah we're in the same time zone dude east coast represent don't just listen to snm i just got into him this year that's right you also listen to tupac and biggie you could uh let me expand your music taste b song all right i'm already gonna be lost again no i need to go up somewhere he's a tree spirit he brings good luck he's a tree spirit chad he brings good luck Shia LaBeouf is a human. It's Shia. It's not Shyla. Why are you guys all saying Shyla LaBeouf? How do you not know Shia? It's Shia LaBeouf, not Shia LaBeouf. Shia LaBeouf. LaBeouf is a word. I've been sheltered my whole life. I don't know who the fuck people are. That's fair. I was sheltered too. My parents did not listen to good music. Did not watch any good movies. I had to establish all of this on my own. You're at the age now where you must spread your wings and fly. And you have the internet, all right? I didn't even have the ability to watch YouTube videos until I was like 16 because we had shit internet. I used to have to pick four YouTube videos at a time, load them up in different tabs, let them all buffer for 30 minutes, walk away, and come back. Okay, boomer. I beat you to it, chat. Don't even fucking type it, all right? I swear to God. I know, all right? I'm, oh my god, my phone. Every time I say, okay, boomer, my phone thinks I'm talking to it. I gotta change that. The okay, boomer meme is like tripping up Google. Google's a boomer confirmed. Every time you say, okay, boomer, Google goes off. What does that tell you about Google? Is that Google's a boomer. Easy. Stupid. Listen to Jack Silver micro pop sometimes. Nice. All right, that's good good that's some good expanded musical taste it is so much easier to get into good music now than it has ever been like honestly though when i was your age in high school like we were still burning and trading cds pandora was just becoming a thing the only online music streaming service that we had when i was like and this was like didn't happen until i was like a teenager in late late uh high school right was pandora became a thing and with Pandora, you could, like, get a radio, and, like, Genius Playlist was starting to become a thing. So, like, that was when AIs first started recommending you music. It was, like, Pandora Radio. You could pick a song, and they get specialized radio, but you couldn't choose what songs to listen to. And you always have to be smart, right? So, like, if you wanted to listen to a song on Spotify, you would have to pick a song that would be related to that song, because uh, Pandora will, like, never, ever play the actual song that this radio is based on. You gotta pick a song that's like related to that song and then hope it plays it, all right? It, it was a game. YouTube videos were not an option because like I said, you would have to spend forever waiting for them to load. I mean, to be fair, high speed internet was more prevalent. I was just really broke and lived in Kentucky, which was a bad mixture if you wanted high speed internet, which I did. Hey, what up gamer girl? All right, fuck you guys. All right, if I thought anybody I could trust was gamer girl, but all right, all right, all right, chat. I'm gonna ban that word. I'm gonna make that a banned word in my chat. This is the country, but the rest of my family likes metal. My mom listens to the country too. She was a horse girl growing up. Gamer Grill is here. Who is Gamer Grill? It's right there. I don't know. It's just the person. Significant extraterrestrial swimming in the sea of life. Nice. Chat, nobody's tried the new command, and it's so it's such a good one. I'm really proud of this. I may. Or may not have had two glasses of wine and then made this command. I am so glad I didn't shoot a pigman right there. Yeah, be dramatic about it, bougie. Oh, I got a guest here. Look at that. Who do I not want to carry? All right, screw this almost dead shovel. I don't need it. Loop. 
X3 Nuzzles pounces on you, ooh will you so warm? Couldn't help but notice your bulge from across the floor. Nuzzles your necky wecky murher hee hee. <laughs> uh, I'm not, I'm a nervous breakdown who's terrified of life. Ugh, feel that man. Wait, what word? I've been trying out German gangster raps. Alright. Ooh woo! Nuzzle, X3 Nuzzles. Dude, I think I'm gonna make it a redeem, but only for like a week. I, that's what I told Kane last night. I was drinking wine, watching Kane stream, and I was trying to find a gif of uh, John Schneider from Papa John to make the Day of Reckoning redeem. And then I was like, I was like, I should make the furry rap of redeem. And you know what? I'm standing by it. I think I'm gonna make it a full redeem with a gif and a sound and everything. Uh, but only for like a week, and then we're gonna take it away because I can't stand it any longer than that. It'll be like a limited time edition redeem. Yeah, my goal is just to make like a hundred redeems at this point, honestly. I think it'd be sick. I just want to make a ton of redeems. No, it sucks. <laughs> like, uh, if I'm a boomer, it's okay to call you a boomer too. I'm not a boomer. I'm a millennial. I hate the capitalist machine. All right. I want universal health care. That's not very boomer. I think we just have to accept that millennials are getting old. Dude, you know, you guys realize that boomers are like 75 years old, right? When I was growing up, boomers were like, back in my day, we'd have to poop in a pot and electricity was run by the- Oh God. Oh no. My God, we just almost died. I almost just pooped my pants a little bit. I hate that command so much. I'm gonna build a gun now. Oof. He mad. Did I borrow that gun and a bullets too? <laughs> That's the exact response I wanted from that command. I think it's the best command out of all the commands. I just want to add a bunch more commands and redeems, you know? We can't get emotes, sadly, because this is YouTube. I mean, I think you kind of can, but it's not going to be the same. And no one's got Twitch Prime, so no one's going to sub anyways. Okay, I need to change this command so that it's... I need to know what the emoji is. It's kissing emoji or kiss. Oh, wait, there's a bunch of them. Which kissy should... It should probably be kissing underscore heart. Or kissing closed eye. Or kissing cat. Cat... Chat, which of the kissing emojis should I use for the kiss? Oh, they've got gay and lesbian kissing. Which kissy should I use? There's so many kissies. You just literally did a back in my day internet was like, I feel like that qualifies you as a boomer. No, I'm not a boomer. I'm a millennial. You guys just don't need to accept that millennials are old. What about Gen Xers? Trevor, as usual, no one is going to talk about Gen X, all right? You're the forgotten generation. Nobody wants to talk about it. <laughs> going to construct your own gun using the new LEGO collection set. Build a gun. Shoot yourself. All right, chat. You know what, chat? One day you'll realize you're getting older. And you'll be like, that was just yesterday. And then you'll be like, no, that was a decade ago. Here's the thing, chat. Once you turn 17, you're gonna spend the rest of your life thinking that you being 17 was three years ago. The band kiss. I hate the band kiss, dude. This one? No. I wanna make it, how about kiss? I think, what was it, kissing? Underscore closed underscore uh, no kissing underscore heart. I think is the winner for me. I want to update this real quick bum, 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 bum. Let's fix it. Let's fix that command I don't think I paused the game <laughs> Yeah, wait, okay, so if I change this to colon, kissing, underscore, closed, underscore, eyes, colon, 
confirm. Now let's try it again. See if it does this one. This one? That's not really a kiss chat. I don't chat, I don't know how you don't know what kissing is, but that's kind of sad for you. Shit to you, my friend. <laughs> hey, Trevor, I don't make the rules of society. Society's all about the war of boomers versus millennials, and Zoomers just keep trying to insert themselves into our narrative by stealing the millennial identity, all right? They're stealing our politics, calling us boomers, trying to group us in with the boomers. Zoomers are committing identity theft, all right? Well, that did not work. All right, what did I type in wrong here? Kissing underscore closed underscore eyes. I don't know why it didn't work. Should have worked. That is how you type out an emoji. But just kissing underscore heart. Did I mistype something? I don't think so. Oh, this is what old Christian would have wanted. Who's old Christian? Zoomers will rise up. Zoomers will never rise up. Not while there's Tide Pods to be eaten. ACDC? I hate ACDC. Not putting bad 80s bands in my commands chat. I joined and Aaron is talking about how Zoomers are doing identity theft. What? I'm just kind of going on a rant chat. Rise up! Kiss. Alright, whatever. I give up. It's dumb. Why does it not work? I don't know. It's dumb. We're just gonna leave it. That's just gonna be the command. All right. That is a. Uh, that is not. That is not kissing. That's a. Uh, that's more of a second or third date thing. Thing there. Uh, no name. Hey yo, hey yo. Oh, I'm doing my usual stupid thing, aren't I? Could be combining all of this glowstone to save inventory space. It's all just gonna be solid glowstone in the end, anyways. I always do this. I always forget to combine the glowstone dust back into glowstone. Oh no. So chat, those of you that weren't here a minute ago, uh, exclamation mark, ooh woo, capital U's, lowercase w, uh, new command, try it out, made it just for you guys, may or may not have been a little wine drunk, but just a little. Yeah. So chat, I did get on a little early today. I gotta do a moving job tomorrow, chat, and I am nervous, all right? It's my second job through, um, task rabbit. And that's not why I'm nervous. I'm nervous because after, yesterday's cleaning job that was also a lot of like moving and organizing which i didn't wasn't worried about my back like really hurt this morning like it was totally fine all day yesterday like didn't feel it at all and then i just woke up this morning and i guess i just like you know kind of locked up from laying still so long and now i gotta move furniture tomorrow and i'm like oh god <laughs> i know i got like the strength for it but i hope i have the back for it when i wake up Chat, one of these days, you're gonna remind me to write down the coordinates of my nether portal so that we can stop getting lost in the nether. Who made who? Who made who? Because I'm TNT! I'm Dino Matt! That's what ACDC sounds like in my head. That's why I don't like him very much. Don't try the Owoo. Do it! Try the awoo, chat. Try the awoo. It's uwu, not oh wow. Wow. Trevor putting some very illicit uh, emojis in the chat. Guys, everybody give a big congratulations to Kane, who beat mm, some stuff with the keeper on Isaac. I can't even remember what he did. Kane, what did you do? You'd be like Mega Satan or something? Is that it? You be Mega Satan with the keeper yet? Hold hold those applause, chat. Hold hold back. Maybe not just yet. Chat is making me uncomfortable. Time to build the cannon. A man needs to be fired out of a cannon in Lego City. Quick, build the cannon. All right. So maybe bring two iron pickaxes with me next time. All right. You know, I'm just gonna go up this way. Make blocks out of quartz. Oh yeah, that's the other thing I came here to do. I'm so dumb, chat. I'm literally looking at an inventory full of quartz, talking about how dumb I am for not uh, doing this with the glowstone dust, and like, doesn't even phase me. 
Chat, you may be asking, is it hard to get through your day-to-day -day life when you're this dumb? And the answer is incredibly. But I am excited to make almost, what, uh, almost $30 an hour tomorrow by moving junk, so that's exciting. And I could have had so much more nether brick and crap in here. Oh, now we've got plenty of inventory. But not plenty of torches, sadly. Yeah, cleaning job was so hard. The guy or I mean, furniture was hard to keep steady. And when you tried dropping them off, well, you know, it can get messy. What? Wouldn't want to piss off the boss? What are you talking about, Kane? What gibberish is this sentence? I don't trust you guys. I have a bad feeling you're one of you who's gonna come push me off. Well, I have no idea where I am or where I've been. If only Cotton Eye Joe was here. Then I could ask him, where did you come from? Where did you go? Where did I come from? Cotton Eye Joe. Just let me go. Just let me go. Let me go. Hey, yo. It's your boy. Let him go. Let the man go. Ow. Um, Carter, I don't know what you're implying with that set of emojis, but it looks like you're implying that that family is gonna, that couple is gonna have sex with that family. Can you don't -ent? Yeah, please. Hey. What? Hey. Chat is me. Yep. Oh, chat. You're a crazy one, chat. But I love you anyways. I actually probably love you more because of that. Would want a boring chat. Not I. Not I. You about to get what's what, you slime blob? I'll tell you what. 10-4, good buddy. Give me that magma cream. My skin's gonna look so youthful when I rub this on it. And or maybe I'm just gonna use it to, you know... Uh -uh -uh -uh. Polish my sword handle so it looks good at the sword ball chat. What did you think I was implying? Ooh, glowstone. Boom, ba -ba -boom, ba -ba -boom, ba -ba -boom. Glowstone that I can reach and it's on ground level. Oh, it's glorious. You're my favorite glowstone of all time. You're the best. You're the best. Uwu sucks. Never get rid of Uwu. That's what I'm hearing. Finally, I can get my revenge on chat. Uwu is my me striking back at chat. But yeah, I'm gonna get off a little earlier. So chat, no, anyways, I keep forgetting to tell this story. So yeah, uh, yesterday, right? I take this task rabbit job to go help this old lady. Not old, old lady. Older lady. Really sweet, really easy to work for, really nice. Um, we had some miscommunications and she was super sweet and nice about it. So I go to help her clean. I get a nice deep clean of her little mini apartment in her niece's uh, basement. It's like a little one bedroom apartment, basically. Like one bedroom, living room, um, and a bathroom. I give it the nice hotel deep clean because I am technically professionally clean trained for cleaning from when I used to work in hotels. Um, and I'm helping her also move and organize a lot of boxes and furniture that because she just moved in. And I'm putting this slip cover over her couch, right? And it's this like spandex stretchy cover that goes over the whole couch. And my hands are really dry because it's winter out. My hands always get super dry in the winter. Uh, and then I've been using cleaning chemicals all day, like really corrosive chemicals. And I, I'm gonna buy a box of vinyl gloves is what I'm gonna do if I'm gonna take more cleaning jobs from TaskRabbit. Uh, but I didn't have them yet. So I'm putting on this white, it's like this white in like color splotched pattern on this thing, right? It looks like an old 70s kind of design with like all the white and like the big like little like splotches of color and stuff. It's, uh, it's hard for me to describe, but uh, you would recognize it if you saw it, right? Chat, also by the way, thank you everybody for stopping by the stream today. You guys are fucking ill. You should go to a doctor. Being here makes you cooler people, and it makes my day. Thank you so much, chat. I love you all. Um, but I, my, my, like, finger right here, it's, like, actually my middle finger. I'm not trying to flick you off. Like, by the knuckle, starts bleeding, and I don't notice it. And the lady looks at her, like, thing, and I'm, like, I'm putting it in on, and I'm stretching it, and I'm tucking it in. What up, ghost boo? And I, um... She stops me and she goes, are you bleeding? And I go, no, I'm not bleeding. And I look down at the 
the thing that I'm putting on and there's blood everywhere dude I'm telling you this thing is like covered in streaks of blood and it's the second one I've put on and I look back at the other one and the other one is also covered in streaks of blood and I look down at my finger and my, like my finger is completely solid red from here to here covered in blood because it's like I don't know if you've ever had that happen but it happens to me sometimes when I get really dry hands it's like you just like you kind of start to bleed right by the knuckle I was so embarrassed, dude. Luckily, it was polyester, and she had, like, some woolite, and it came out. But I probably spent an extra 30 minutes cleaning because of that. And I had to, like, clean up all my blood, dude. It was... It felt so embarrassing, dude. Like, I'm here putting on this lady's brand new couch cushion and just bleeding profusely everywhere. So that was horrifying. And that's how she contracted all sorts of disease. I'm worried about contracted disease. Dude, you know what she says to me? She looks at me when after that, and she's super nice, and she doesn't get mad. I clean it all up. We're all Gucci. And she, like, she looks at me, and she goes, don't worry. It came from China, but it, I bought it way before the corona virus started. I was like, oh, no. God, dude. All right, let me catch up on chat real quick. Uh, a man was lost in the nether in Lego City. Build the therapy room because he's not coming back. Jesus. Currently in an insane asylum? Have fun, I guess. Sounds padded. Sounds fun. Decided to go out and try and find some new rappers to listen to because you're judging me? Listen to Chance the Rapper. Listen to Lupe Fiasco. Listen to, uh, I can give you rap. Just listen to my music suggestions on, uh, Discord. Chat, I'm trying to post one song a day on Discord, so if you're not on our Discord, or if you are on our Discord, you should participate in the music more. I'm trying to get more music going on there. Time to grease the old hog? Gross. I thought you were implying polishing door handles so they look nice. I uh, no, but, you know, that's exactly what I'm talking about, chat. Disgusting. Door handles aren't supposed to look nice. They're supposed to look well-worn. Ronnie Redyke is a good rapper? I might have to check him out. Don't take Aaron's advice on rap artists. I have great musical taste, thank you. Uwu should be illegal. I tell you what, chat, every time you make fun of Uwu, I'm just going to type it into the chat. Every time you mention it, chat, I could make it not a command. I could just make it anytime you type in Uwu, it pops up. And falling in reverse. Combine your glowstone now. Yep, yep, yep. I'm doing it. Wigwam gave an old lady a deep cleaning. Stop. Stop. I decided to look up a German gangster rap because that's the most popular music in Germany and I'm taking German classes and I just listen to this guy, Jesus, even though I don't know what the fuck he's, he's saying. That's a good way to learn foreign languages though, is just immerse yourself in music or movies by it. I actually had a guy who told me this and he learned to speak Spanish by watching Star Wars in Spanish, first with subtitles and then without subtitles and then he actually like learned to speak Spanish that way. What's Gucci, my gamers? You know, I know I ever take advice from you, Wigwam. Your life would be a lot better if you did. That's what I want, Mr. Wigwam. You can't judge me. I can judge you. Uh, I do need a doctor. We all need doctors. Oh, no. My doctor recommended a watch of your channel. Dude, Wigwam recommended by four out of five doctors. The fifth doctor is a fan of Jake Paul. So who are you going to listen to? Did it look like a crime scene? It did somewhat look like a crime scene. It was bad. They did a woman like that once. Couldn't put on... Uh, da -da -da. I keep chat keeps jumping on me, dude. Message retracted. What if she got turned out by your bleeding? I don't know what you mean by that. Combine your cords. I'm getting to it, alright? What would you do it? No, ew, gross, no. Ew, gross, no. Ew, gross, no. It was like a 60-year-old heavy set woman in very poor health, which is why she needed to hire a cleaner. Not to be mean to anybody, but like, this, I, I'm just not, that's not what I bat for, alright? We can't build a helicopter in the nether, bad idea. It would probably explode if you tried to get into it like a bed. Ooh woo, X3 puzzles, now, wait, X3 nuzzles, pounces on you, ooh woo, you so warm. Couldn't help but notice is your bulge from across the floor, nuzzles your necky wecky. Chad, I'll do the whole thing, don't make me look it up. Chad, if you keep complaining about ooh woo, I will stop and wrap the uh, furry wrap, alright? A grandma has fallen and can't get up in Lego City. I will ever, 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 ever take your rap. Never, ever. Wow, that's your loss, dude. It's a really stupid thing to say because I have great taste in rap. Can you get rid of it? No, I'm not getting rid of it. My brother used to watch a movie in Spanish so he could practice and understand. Dude, that's actually, well, it's a really great strategy. 
You can't ban Streamlabs. It's already a mod. Those are the best ones. Okay, I mean, Kane, then you go. You go bad for her. Don't put me in your creepy fan fiction, Kane. Kane's over here writing head fiction because that's what he's into. And he's like, oh, yeah, tell me she got turned on when he started bleeding on her nude cover. Kane, bro. I'm not saying you're sick, but I am saying stop it. Get some help. Make it stop. I will unsub if you do that rap. I mean, I don't want you to unsub, but I don't like to be told not to do stuff. Oh yeah, what the fuck do you know about rap? I've been listening to rap since you've been, uh... Oh god. How old are you? I've been listening to rap since you've been listening to fucking baby geniuses. Alright, let's play the how the hell do we get back to our home base. Literally doing that right now. Stop! She probably loves to snuggle. I mean, she probably does. I mean, I won't lie. She'd probably be great to snuggle with. In that regards, you got me, Chad. Someone made a rap in health class today about disease. It was actually fire. His flow was on point. Nice. Well, that kind of reminds me of that episode of Kimmy Schmidt where he like goes to do the rap. And then they're like all ready to like film him and make fun of him and turn him into a viral sensation for all the wrong reasons. All right, chat. So we literally just gonna have to kind of wander around the nether until we find our way back out again, huh? This could take a minute. BRB. All right, you like the guy who thinks Vanilla Ice is dangerous gangster? Bro, I think that's literally you since all you listen to is one white rapper. Listening to rap since Bob Marley, nice. Look, Kane, I'm just gonna say, or not Kane, b -son. I'll just say, if you're not open into expanding your musical taste and listening to other people's opinion, that pretty much shows me everything I need to know about your musical taste. Having an open mind to music is the number one, like, way to tell if somebody potentially has good taste in music, I feel like. If you're willing to listen and take chances on new sounds and new ideas and new genres, then I have a lot more respect for what you think is good or not. If you don't, if you're not willing to take chances, then... I'm not gonna respect whether or not what you think is like good. Okay, this is my path back home. Okay, I know exactly where we are. Wow, that was incredibly lucky. <laughs> Fun fact, there is a picture of Vanilla Ice and Guy Fiari together and they both look unhappy. That's hilarious. Guy Fiari looks like the kind of person that would listen to Vanilla Ice though, if we're being honest. Why don't you date an older woman? Me, a young Zoomer dating a 37-year-old woman. You're dating a 37-year-old woman? What? Give me five rappers you listen to. I feel like I should pull up my Spotify. Uh, Lupe Fiasco, I've listened to like a billion hours of all of his albums. Chance the Rapper, always, always great stuff. Well, not the, not the I Love My Wife album, but you know, before that was some great stuff. Um, Twista is great. I want to cheat and look at my phone. Rockhampton's great. Chat, I might get to go see Brockhampton live. They're coming to the the music festival here in Louisville this year. Here, let me let me actually well let me go. Wow, wrong side. It's always like raining when I come out of a Nether portal. You ever notice that, chat? It's like always raining when I come out of the Nether. Right down the coordinates. Oh my god. Alright, you know what? Honestly, let's go into this real quick. I'm gonna go back into the nether real quick just to write down the coordinates. And while I'm doing that, I'm gonna pull up Spotify. Who have I been listening to? I can't remember his name. I'm not good at, like, remembering names of new artists and stuff. Alright, it's on my recently liked songs. I've been listening to... Where is it? Uh, White Girl Wasted by Johnny Polygon. Johnny Polygon's really good. I listened to a lot of Johnny Polygon recently. Uh, is Anderson Pack rap? I don't know. Is Anderson Pack technically rap? I listen to a ton of Anderson Pack. Anderson Pack is amazing, dude. Run the Jewels is rap, dude. Run the Jewels is amazing. Tons and tons. Dude, run the jewels. You should listen to run the jewels. There you go. There's a good suggestion for everybody. Schoolboy Q is great. 
Uh, oh man, you know what's a really great album is that uh, Kid See Ghost album with Kid Cudi and uh, what's his face? Nope. This is my door, you asshole! Rude! Okay, what are the coordinates? The coordinates are. I'm gonna write them down on my phone. Negative 22.3. 68 229.9 X Y Z Nether Portal Boom saved. All right, I finally wrote it down chat Did you really say Brockhampton for a rapper Brockhampton is a rap or group I'm gonna try to cool you down if you're coming back from literal hell, maybe Oh, did you put black steps up? I put nether brick steps up. I think it look pretty sick. I love Run the Jewels. I got to see Run the Jewels live at Bunbury last year, and they were sick live, dude. They're so good live. They can keep up with all their music live. Like, sometimes you see uh, rap live. Are there, oh, are there those things around? Yeah. I mean, I'll kill you if you want. I, mean, I could use more more loot, I guess. Actually, these guys are kind of easier to kill with flame sword. Where's my crossbow? These guys are pretty hard to hit with a crossbow. It is raining really hard. Yeah, no, come back, come back. <laughs> I want to hit you. I'll give you a good whacking. I'm back down here, you cowards! And I want to get that like double shot. If I can get him with the crossbow and the sword, with that one-two combo, you know. Ow! How did that miss? Absolute shenanigans going on here. Nice. I don't know what I really need these for, but it just feels like something I should collect because it's rare. Was 18 was happy to be the toy of a 32-year-old at the same time for about six months, so I can relate. Aww. Y'all had a real, uh, graduate type situation going on there, huh? That's a good movie. Kinda creepy. Would have a very different context in a reverse situation. You can't make the graduate about an old guy and a young girl, I feel like. Well, no wait, that's a lie. That's literally every, uh, what's that director's name? Not Woody Harrelson. Woody Allen. That's literally every Woody Allen movie ever. I want to see him live as my first concert. Hopefully he will perform to be murdered by this year. Wait, who do you want to see live this year? That would be the... Da, da, da. Isn't fishing better while it's raining? I mean, who cares about fishing? I want to see him live as my first concert. You haven't been to a concert, B-Son? Nope, apparently not. Maybe we should go do some infinite fishing chat. Would you like that? I know how chats just love to watch the most mundane things on Minecraft. Don't pretend like you don't, chat, because we all know you do. You can just go ahead and start getting this nether brick firing right now. No coal in this one. No coal in this one either. This one's been neglecting their chores and not putting coal in here. This is me. I'm, I'm that guy. We have like a bunch of coal, don't we? Yeah, that's what I thought. Tons and tons of coal. Ahmed Mohammadi. What's up, man? How's it going? Welcome to the stream. One of my favorite Dustin Hoffman movies next to Little Big Man. Dude, The Graduate's a great movie. I don't know any singers. All right. I want to see... Oh, you want to... You said... You don't mean, like, M as in, like, them. You mean M and M. Gotcha. Did I tell you the time I tried dating a substitute teacher? I never got to go to a concert until I could drive myself to a concert. And I started going to lots of concerts. No, please tell us about the time you tried to date a substitute teacher so that we can laugh at your expense. I'm just kidding, but I really want to hear this story now. I've been to two behemoth Gojira Volbeat and Slipknot. Nice. I've been to a ton of concerts. A new viewer or just a new beast on? Instead of a normal Minecraft fishing, let's play that zombie fishing game? No. Does Aaron get new viewers? Come on, it's me. I'm good and ill. 
You're ill? Nice. I mean, not nice. I was gonna say... I mean, like, you're ill? Nice. I'm pretty ill myself, dude. I know some rad skateboard tricks. But then I just realized I was like, oh, you're sick? Great. This is why I don't do well in social situations. <laughs> Man, we're gonna have to go strip mining again soon. We're actually kind of starting to run low on some supplies here. That's not me. Or is it? I don't know. I mean, she would stop using fake accounts on my channel so that I could know if I got new viewers or not. Alright, most of this quartz is gonna go downstairs once it gets finished. Some nice glowstone going as well. I have a lot of glowstone dust again, don't I? What are we gonna do with all this glowstone? We just build an ugly ass house out of glowstone. Sounds perfect, chat. You nailed it. That's exactly what we're gonna do. Chat, you're always so filled with good ideas. I love it. Definitely not filled with horrible ideas ever. It's okay. Sorry you're sick, man. I just uh, I just got over being sick myself and it sucked. I got sick, even though this is basically what I do, is sit inside and stream and not leave the house because I haven't been working much recently. And uh, I went outside to go grocery shopping. That was the extent of my outdoorsy time. And um, I got sick, which seems unfair. Doesn't feel like you should spend that much time indoors and then uh, get sick for four days. I was pretty sick, dude. I, I was pretty sick, honestly. Like, I don't, well, actually, that's not true. It was like, oh, like mild escalating into a medium amount of sickness for uh, across four days. But it was just annoying because you know how like when you're sick and you're like, every morning you wake up from being sick, you're like, maybe today will be the day that I'm not sick anymore. And like you do that mental stock in your head when you first wake up, you're like, am I sick? And you're like, fuck, I'm sick. And then sometimes you're even like, am I sick? You're like, oh, I'm sicker than I was. God dang it. That's how it feels. The chew fine gum. Not really. All right, chat. Let's see what we're level 43. Let's see if we could get a stupid looting charm on the sword yet, dude. I think I could get my first girlfriend, but I don't know. It seems fast at 16. Uh, when did I have my first girlfriend? I had a girlfriend at... I don't remember how old I was. Freshman year of high school? Ugh. The problem is, like, there's multiple enchantments, right? So... If we enchanted it, there's a chance we could get something else good. Impaling, smite, protection... Those are really bad. Just do that. How about now? Same thing! God dang it. I don't want to go too low level, dude. It's totally survivable. Stop saying I had coronavirus, chat. It's not funny. It's a serious illness. <laughs> got it made, got it made. I gotta turn this down real quick. It's a little too loud for me. I've never had a girlfriend, never will, because of very ugly waste of space. Her ass with people on the internet with 27 different accounts. Bison, we all love you. Shut up. Don't talk bad about you. Don't talk bad about my favorite viewer, Bison. I had to skip school today, and I mean secondary. Did you do you not like skipping school? Because I mean I didn't like being sick when I was in college, mostly because I'd have to go anyways. But like I loved skipping high school. Remember his girlfriend took advantage of me when I was only 15? She should be ashamed. Wow, I mean, was she also 15? Trevor, is this like a serious thing? Like, should we, do you need a hug? After that, it was a bit awkward. Wait, oh yeah, here we go. I was 17 turning 18. This is Kane's story time, all right? I was 17 turning 18 and had a beautiful English substitute teacher. I told all of my friends about my true feelings. There were some other people that flirted with her in class too. I did some stupid Valentine's Day shenanigans and well, she didn't want to get in trouble, so nothing really happened. Yeah, that's right, Kay. That's why it didn't happen was because she didn't want to get in trouble. And after that, it was a bit awkward. <laughs> oh, my God. I have a Valentine, but nothing more than a friend. Hey, man. Getting Valentine's is a step in the right direction, dude. It's good practice time. Be sweet. Be nice. Be caring. Be friendly. Make jokes. Be a friend. Be a friend more than anything. But also be sweet. Be like the nicest friend ever. And just use it as practice time, you know? It's like a no hole, no pressure situation practice. So it's great. I got it made, got it made, got it made. I'm hot for teacher. Hot for teacher. Ha 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 ha. Also, it was really rude of you to say I don't get new viewers, B-san. 
mean. Chat, luckily for you, if you're trying to get a girlfriend, girls go for ugly guys all the time. Look at how people like Adam Driver. All right, Adam Driver, Adam Driver can be famous and women can think he looks good, then everybody has a chance. No one is ugly anymore. Ugliness is canceled. Thank you, Adam Driver. What time is it for you? It's 22.15 for me and I like skipping secondary. I love skipping high school and middle school, especially middle school. Uh, it's 5.15 p.m. I'm on the east coast of America, baby. He isn't, but one of his accounts is nice. Buy lights of chocolate. She was 14. Wow. Sounds like you took advantage of her. Shoot up my school and I'm not lying. Wow, dude, loneliness makes people do crazy things. Buy lots of chocolate. Ugh, don't talk to me about chocolate. I'm avoiding sweets right now on my diet and health kick. And I'm feeling pretty good about myself and I'm looking better and better. But it hurts, man. I miss ice cream so bad. You have no idea. All right. Why, why is Beast on your favorite viewer? He's not. He just needed to pick me up. He's one of my favorite viewers. Buy lots of chocolate. You're all my favorite viewers. I love all my children equally. Should I just go for it, chat? I can just go for it. We need looting. I need the loot, baby. Books, books, books. More dumb enchantment books that I won't use. Impaling, fire protection, efficiency, fire protection. I should just make a new sword. I should just make a bunch of swords until one of them lets me get looting. Let's let's Google this real quick. Best way to get looting enchantment in Minecraft. Dun, 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 dun. A 13 minute video sounds great <laughs> except terrible except really awful drop more items than normal yeah I, we know what looting does what tips for getting it this is not what I asked for I guess there's no like good way to cheese it dude my viewer or that one shady kid in the corner playing Yu-Gi-Oh by himself I mean you're at least a listener 16 broke boy and doing that what you gotta do is what I did but only if you're single you gotta be friends with a streamer then ask her to be your valentine then ask her jokingly say yes but little does she know you're in collaboration with her cousin to buy her caramel chocolates yellow and purple flowers get it Kane my boy is making moves I'm ugly I make a quasimodo from hunchback of Notre Dame like a fucking Luigi I've seen you be son you look like a normal kid man I'm a viewer or that? Yeah, yeah. Aaron, make me an AFK fish farm. Okay. Done. It's right there. I already made that. Let's go fish. Go fish. How do you make a fishing pole? I straight up do not remember. <laughs> Yo, chat, who wants to buy some chocolates? Because I am straight up dying to sell them. You tried fudge? Bro, I love fudge. Especially all the flavored fudges. That's like one of the best things like when you go out camping or whatever. Is like all those little like camping souvenir stores have amazing fudge. How do you make a fishing pole? Is it sticks, string, and iron? I think. My string. I have tons of string. She's going to be super surprised because she has low self-esteem and always talks about it. She wants a boyfriend who loves her and makes her feel like one... Mil dollar millions one millions dollars Kane's gonna make her feel like one millions dollars guys Okay, I don't remember <laughs> make a fishing rod Oh, that's it. All right. There's no iron involved Yeah, I'll make two Chad are you ready to go fishing? Let me hear you make some noise for fishing! Or not, that's cool too. Be quiet and subdued, that's fine. I mean, it's whatever. All instructions, I don't know, chat. <laughs> and that's how you get a girlfriend or a restraining order, depending on how you do that in chat. Okay, so is this like a girl you live near in real life? Like, or is this like a purely online relationship? But you said KFC fish farm? I'm like, what? Dude, I would love to fish KFC. Coco is my favorite beans other than coffee and kidney. You like kidney beans better than chocolate beans? You disgust me. Absolutely disappointed to hear you say that. You can't pick me up. Why do you think I have so many personalities? I'm trying to fix myself. 
Step one is confidence. If you don't have it, just fake it. Step two, uh, just keep acting confident. Step three, if you're a guy, it's always easy to be attractive. It's unfair, I know, but it is always easy. Start working out, get a good haircut, wear some clothes that fit you correctly. Boom, you have become attractive, guys. It's just that easy for us. It's not fair, I know. It's some BS, but it is absolutely 100% true. I'm telling you, chat. If you're a guy and you want to be attractive, that is literally all you have to do. Start working out, get a good haircut, get a good uh, outfit. Until you get a girlfriend. Yep. Uh, you work at Walmart, that's how big of a stalker you are. How do I don't work at Walmart, but how would working at Walmart make me a stoker? What Also, what is a stoker? Is it someone who stokes a fire? Not a lake, an AFK fish farm. A little mango will help you. I... I... You'll see. You'll see, Carter. Wow, 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 fishing. Is that good? Yeah, that's great. Thank you. You don't need two fishing rods. You need two fishing rods. We can at least put a zombie skin on. No. Uh, I'll be your Minecraft experts. Nice. I could use some more Minecraft help. Fish heads, fish heads, roly roly fish heads. What? And then... <laughs> what? Eat them up, yum. I've known her cousin for over half a decade and known her for a long time. Cool. Good luck, Kane, my boy. Make some moves, dude. I do fake confidence. It's not there. Yeah, make a fish tank. Ugh, I'm not making the fish tank yet, dude. That doesn't sound like confidence. Just ask me if you have any problems. Will do. I have problems getting this started all the time. I go over here to do this. I struggle to get it started. What the fuck are you doing here, chicken? What the fuck? It's like this, right? Is this how you fish farm? Or do I have to do more like... Yeah! Fishing! Stalker. Oh, was that a wordplay joke? It's saying I stock shelves? Did Bison correctly spell a word in order to do wordplay? I'm amazed. I think I'm doing this wrong. I think it's more like I never know like where to throw it to start it. Or can you do R? What? Can I do R? You need to fake confidence if you're a good actor, role player, which is what I uh, sometimes do in social scenarios. Confidence is all you need to attract women. Eh, I don't think that flies anymore. I think that's kind of an antiquated thing. I think that Tinder is uh, really giving an edge up on the hot boys. All right, did that work? Did I catch something? Did I catch something and it went down here? There's experience points. That's right. Why does it? What did I do wrong here that it always goes into the hoppers instead of like into the inventory? Hey chat, can I weight this down? I don't want to hold this down the whole time. I don't think I have anything to like weight it down. I was thinking what I should do is like, I think I was thinking if I could take like some chapstick and a rubber band, I could just rubber band it down. Oh god. This mic sucks now. I need a new mic arm. Can you do redstone? I can. I mean, I don't know. What do you want me to do with redstone? For my next move, I will use pot of green. This card lets me pull two cards in my hand. How do you know what I look like? Because you stream with a camera before. It's easy to fake confidence if you're a psychopath. That's true. Psychopaths do have an unfair advantage in that regard. Women love money, so just become rich dummies. Again, I think you guys have some really antiquated views on what flies for the whole, like, men getting ahead thing. I don't know, man. Any woman that would just marry you for your money, I feel like you're probably getting what you deserve there if you're marrying. If you're marrying for looks and she's marrying for money, then you two probably deserve each other. You put the chest under the hopper. But then how do you stack it up? Was I want to... Because I want it... I thought it was in next to the hopper. Are you sure? I have watched most of your streams before we've been over this. Alright, well this is boring. Not doing this. 
But I can uh, I can leave some fishing rods here, luckily. My profile is not me, but it is beautiful. <laughs> it's very beautiful. Very much represents your soul. Give them beats, son. Give them shroot farm beats. Chapstick and a rubber band. More like Vaseline and a dirty sock to me. Alright, calm down there, bud. Calm the heck down there. Alright, great. Now I finally have got beats for some reason. I don't know what that reason is, but I got them. That seems like a step in the right direction. So we got some more carrots if I ever wanted to start a pig farm, which I don't really. I also don't really have room, so it seems a little, like, uh, pointless. That's why fishing sucks. You know, well, that's why it's supposed to be an AFK fishing farm and not, uh, not, like, a, a K fishing farm. An AK fishing farm at keyboard. Bro! You have any idea how rude it is for you to be along that skinny ass... Narrow little ledge, trying to attack me and my farm. Not getting married unless it benefits me in some way financially, otherwise it seems so expensive for a giant party. Kane's a gold digger confirmed. Kane's a total gold digger, man. Bro, stop it. Get some help. Stop trying to fight for my attention, skeleton. Maybe just go pop into the chat if that's what you wanted. Okay, and, you know, I respect the gold digging ways, I guess. I don't want those. I'm gonna plant more potatoes here. Boop, 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 boop. Potato, potato. Won't you please take my potato away? Oh, yeah, we never found melons, did we? I forgot we were looking for melons at one point. I really want a looting sword before I go back out into the world, though. Because I want to be able to take healing potions. Oh, but we yeah. So I'm just realizing this. So we will need healing potions before we go to the end. Then you can add the redstone to sword it in a chest. You put the chest under the hopper. Oh, it goes into the red chest. Oh, you need to add redstone. All right. You ever watched one of my streams? I think you'd appreciate that my profile pic is a me. Looks like a duck in a blender. Isn't your profile picture Pepe laid like Trump or something? You have a fish in between the crops that would probably help fertilize the crops. I don't think that's how fertilization or fish work, but okay. It will these regrow new pumpkins? Okay, he got me. Now he's gotta die. Look, dude, you could have just not done that and you wouldn't have had to have died. You're gonna die too. But now you gotta make a whole big scene about it. Now I gotta come kill you. Where'd you go, dumbass? This is your fault. Oh, there's another one, huh? There's another one. We got two funny guys here. Two funny guys in the mix. One haha -ha funny, one more of an ironical sense of humor kind of guy. Both of them dead. Maybe I should extend my fence more into this area. I always just feel so pointless until now where I'm like being shot at and murdered. Feels less pointless now. I'm gonna go all King Kong on you, son. Fish die, fish poop. It would settle near the roots of the crops. I don't think you can keep a fish in there. Doesn't seem like a very good place to keep a fish, alright? Seems cruel to the fish, honestly. You done messed up now. This is your own fault. You should feel responsible for your own actions. Wow, that's a uh, should not have used the shears on that. That actually tore them up. Didn't think that would count towards their usage. Chad, I need to do so many things in this game right now, but I'd still really love to find a rainforest. Finding a rainforest and getting melons would be a big boon. 
So I can start a melon farm and then have like glistening metal melons ready to go for potions. Hell, one step at a time, right? Have you gone to the end? No, I haven't gone to the end yet. I don't think I've ever been to the end, actually. I used to play this game, the end didn't exist. They added it much later. We'll get there eventually, we're getting close. The whole- the goal is to get a, a looting sword by the end of this stream. And then once we get a looting sword, we can start looking for endermen to quickly gain a bunch of ender pearls. And then we will want to get healing potions before we go out into um, the end as well. Those are kind of our last checklist uh, items to do. Oh yeah, it's the sheep that got in the wrong part of the pen. Alright, get a little cutty-cutty here. Probably going to break these shears in here, but you know what? It's fine. They've served us well. Oof. Well, that's what you get for wasting all your, uh... All your shears on sugarcane like a big dum-dum. Excuse me? What? This new melon's like Daytona Beach during spring break? Wow. <laughs> Excuse me? The fuck did you just say to me? I keep forgetting I need to come over here and put actual, like, official lighting in here, too. Put just random torches on the ground. Not really up to my normal design standards, I must say. A little disappointed in me. Cows. I kind of need to just make more cows. Used to having hundreds and hundreds of cows. That's a compliment. Do you know what Psycraft is? Uh, I don't think I've heard of Psycraft. Time you mine a crop of the tool, it goes towards its health. Like if I use like a, that's I don't know. I guess I was back and forth because that's what I originally thought, but then I like was using pickaxes on dirt on accident a little bit. And felt like it wasn't degrading them, but I guess maybe it was just degrading them by so little I didn't understand. Why do Scottish herders wear kilts? Do not make a Scottish people fucking sheep joke, alright? Do not do it. Sorry, chicken. Life's harsh and then you die. It's so much experience for killing the chickens, but I don't feel good about it. They're just dumb, defenseless chickens, alright? They never stood a chance! Shouldn't be rewarded with experience points for killing these guys. My inventory full? It sure is. Oh, it's full because of all the eggs. Stupid eggs, man. Maybe if you wouldn't, like, immediately take damage after I hit you with the eggs. So many eggs, chat. So many eggs! Who could ever take this many chicken eggs? Who would ever want this many chicken eggs? Egg pipes play. The sound of zipper spooks the sheep. Yep, yep, yep. A bunch of geniuses play Minecraft? Nice. Bagpipes play. Stop. Stop it. <laughs> I don't know why I went and picked up more eggs. I don't want more eggs. I just want to make more chickens to eat later. No, some of those chickens spawned in the wrong pen. Or I think I like pushed them over the fence side by spamming them so much. Can you attack the chickens with their eggs? Yeah, it's actually an annoying problem because you can't, like, not attack them with their eggs. I'm trying to throw them to spawn more baby chickens and they're, like, always getting in the way. Oh, 
Only seven people play. Ugh. You make a cake with that? I could make a cake with a lot of stuff. I've already got enough stuff to make a cake. I don't need more stuff, dude. Ah! Get out of my inventory. Leave me alone. Being harassed by chicken eggs, dude. Do you have any idea what it's like to be emotionally tormented by chicken eggs? Probably not. It's a very unique experience that not a lot of people are going to encounter in their day-to-day -day lives. Most people probably go their entire existence and never experience the pain that I've just been forced to endure. You wouldn't get it though, chat. You just wouldn't get it. I don't know what else to tell you. Am I roast pumpkins? No. Cowards! What other foods do I have? I do have a bunch of cooked chickens. It's gonna be time to switch to cooked chickens pretty soon. Only seven people play? What? Watching. Seven people watching? Only seven people watching. Look, bro, not everybody's ninja, alright? Some of us are happy to have seven people watching. For a lot of small streamers, seven concurrent viewers is pretty good numbers. See, kids have really unrealistic views of what, like, your average stream is like. Not everybody's ninja, man. Not everybody gets those, you know... Them big, big boy numbers. No, I'm not a full-time streamer. I don't make money off this. I wish I did. It's one baby step at a time, you know. Those guys were at this level at one point, too. Bat tubs reverse boats or is it the other way around? Stop asking that. I swear to God, I, I'm gonna have to ban the word bathtub out of my chat next. Is that what it's gonna take? Am I gonna have to ban the word bathtub? Is that what you want, chat? Is that what you want, chat? All right, more feathers, more uh, whatever this stuff is. You guys want me to build a fish tank, huh? I do need to go down my little stairs here. Uh, I guess while I'm doing all this farming, I should uh, pop all this too. Stuff's so easy to farm. I was pretty surprised we just randomly hit 10 viewers earlier on the Minecraft stream. We've really been popping off recently, chat. You guys have been really uh, improving your attendance, guys. Finally. Alright, this whole area is such a mess still. Because I'm so short on quartz. Still got a lot of work to do in this general vicinity. General vicinity. He plays Java. Hey, what's up, Sergio? Hello, do you want to play with me? <laughs> do you want to play with me? Look chat, if I didn't have Java, I would be down to play with a lot more of you guys. I wish we could just have like an easy going like mutual server to play on, but sadly just not meant to be. Well, I forgot I actually got all of this uh, knocked out. It's pretty great. We can build a little more down here. Probably starting with a bunch of stairs. Getting a nice stack of stairs going would be uh, excellent. Excellente. Go in here. Take these as well. For whatever dumb reason, my stone cutter is still upstairs, so we'll go upstairs. Should probably move it. Doesn't really make sense up here. Okay, we already have plenty of quartz pillar. I don't think we'll need any more of that. We'll need a ton more of this. Probably need at least one stack of that. What is the other one? What was I making the roof out of? Was it just plain quartz? I think it was just plain quartz. So many souls to play. So many would agree. What? Some Picasso paintings in this room. I could put some paintings up. Friend has 30k on TikTok, so he's ninja. He is ninja. You're friends with ninja. Someone gift this man bedrock already. Bro, if somebody gifted me bedrock, I would host the server. But uh, I don't see that happening, so... Tough nuts, guys. Yeah. Okay, it's like that. 
Wait, this isn't gonna work. I feel like I should probably do it more like, uh... Where are these blocks going? I just heard them place. And they like, but they weren't placing. Bro. You gotta like... It's in the way, what is going on? Hey, no, almost. There we go. Well, we know that part's correct at least. Oh, that's not correct. Oh, I fudged this up. I fudged it all up, chat. Oh, this has got to be a stairs. This has got to be a stairs. This is a stairs. Chat, is this getting monotonous enough for you yet? This is a stairs. This is a Applebee's. Yeah, that's how you do it. Most of the time, we just have enough people to have a full squad in Fortnite. True, we've been getting better and better numbers recently. Getting pretty good numbers, man. I'd love to play Minecraft with like a more group setting. Alright, so it needs to be like this. Yeah, that's the pattern. I guess I could take these out. Don't fight me on this. That and then that. Okay. I'm gonna have to redo some of this. I'm gonna make it be like this. That's what it should have been the whole time. Nice. Oh, we can use this granite to fill in this hole here. Thumbs up reminder. Yeah, remember to like the stream. Por favor, senores. Gracias. What's the tell you? Yeah. Who remembers when the Enderman picked up Bedrock and just placed them on your base? Wait, was that a thing? Was that a thing? Oh my god, dude. I'd be livid. Oh, I would lose it. I would straight up lose it, dude. You have no idea. <laughs> you have no idea the words that would come out of my mouth. You probably do. But they'd be adult words. You would be surprised to hear them so passionately and quickly coming out of my face hole that I call my mouth. I like to call it my face hole because it sounds weird and people are like, why would you say it like that? Uh, it makes me feel uncomfortable. And I'm like, that's why, baby. That's why. How have I messed this up? Okay, like... Am I the dumbest person? Don't answer that, chat. It's a trap. It's a total trap. I need some regular, like, cobblestone blocks in my inventory if I'm going to be doing a build. What are you doing, chat? If you played in a group setting, I would have the chance to virtually pester you in virtual life. Dear God, dude. <laughs> I feel like you're trying... You're supposed to be incentivizing me to do this, but that is not <laughs> incentivizing me to do this. Should have just done an outward staircase again, man. Way easier than this whatever contraption I'm doing here. Cause I ended up making this so much like larger. Alright, that's it. I fixed it! I'm a genius chat. Never let anybody ever tell you anything differently. Only Aaron can make a nostalgic feel a uh, beg moment. What does that sentence mean? A nostalgic feel a beg moment? Yes, you are. We are all on the road to Rhode Island. What is going on with you, chat? Are you, is chat, are you collectively having a stroke? Or am I having a stroke? Uh oh, that does seem more likely. Shit. <laughs> Average human has five exposed face holes. Can I have a shout out? Uh, I mean, in, in what regard? Shout out to you! 
You know you love me. It's Valentine's season after all. I love you all, chat. Some of you more than others. Try and rank yourself in the order that you think I love you the most, chat. I'd be interested to see how wrong you are. Have you finished those errands? You finished those errands? Aaron? Errands? Errands? Finish with those errands and I never will be! Just quit asking me. Ah, uh, chat, the delay's still on, isn't it? I'm so dumb, I always forget to turn this off and on. You are an idiot. Wow, that's really rude. That's, uh, that's really mean. Uh, would say that maybe, you know, asking someone who's never seen your content for a shout out is kind of an idiotic thing to do. That's why I don't get chat. I always bring this up because it always happens, but it's just like Why do people ask for shout outs from people who've never seen their content before? I don't know. I'm not gonna shout out your content. Even if I did, I've never seen your stuff. So like why would my shout out mean anything? Like chat, would you go watch someone's content if somebody shouted it out, but they were like, I've never seen it before? I will be last obviously <laughs> We big in the mind, we got our picket. I don't know. I know that's a song, but I don't know the song. That's too old. Too old for that song, chat. I hate these little pillar blocks always placing the wrong direction. You answered your own question. No, I didn't. Um. Whatever. I'm just gonna ignore it, cause luckily for me, I don't really care that much. <laughs> Alright, these pillars are looking good. The walls are just gonna be normal blocks of quartz. These stairs are not working for me, dude. These stairs are not doing it for me. You finished those errands? You finished those errands? 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 I'm not finished with those errands and I never will be! Alright, so these stairs are not... They need to be... How does this need to work? I gotta think about this for a second. I probably should have started at like the top, I guess, and then gone down and out from there. Maybe I should just make them like this. This was a great design. All right, what is this? This is three, and then it just kind of gets wider, and then it makes like this pyramid shape. Yeah, I'm just gonna do that. That seems way easier. Just like this. Actually, we'll just make this one start with two. I think it's a better design, and it's an easier design, so. We'll go with that. I'm gonna go with it because it's easier and it's better. It seems like really good reasons to do something, right, chat? Alright, and they're coming down to here. Points, 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 points. You don't know revenge? What is up with you? What? No, I don't. I mean, I, I know of it. Bro, I, I'm older than that. I don't know what you want, chat. Chat's turning against me. No! I knew it would happen eventually. I just didn't think it would happen so soon. Yes, I did. My name's not Rick. What? Yeah, you're just like spouting gibberish and I... Well, no, that's pretty much standard for you. I was going to say I'm starting to get worried, but no, nah, that seems like normal chat stuff to do. So I need to like initially build the shape out of cobblestone, right? Ah, uh, no. Bad cobblestone block. When you said, am I the biggest idiot when you did the stairs pattern? Oh, you answered your own question. Oh, uh, okay. No, that's fair. Yeah, that's, yeah. That's fair. <laughs> he got me there. That is correct. I am the world's biggest idiot. That's why we have the Redeem Big Dumb. The big, Redeem Big Dumb is my favorite because it's the most commonly used. Yeah, I've really grown to like this particular lo-fi song. Okay. Hey. 
all right chat what do you think like that coming down i think that's better than the one upstairs the one upstairs is like it starts with three wide or no it doesn't it's two and a half wide because that's a corner block okay no so this is the same because then this will be like this oh yeah you nailed it he nailed it dude yes 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 Uh, we don't want to lose any quartz blocks that we don't need to, though. Just take all these blocks up for now. While we're working out the, uh, the kinks from this situation. This kinky situation right here. This situation? You committed crimes against Aaron and his people. What say you in your defense? Can I have a biscuit? That was the correct answer. Biscuit like a cookie? Like a British biscuit? Or like a biscuit biscuit? Revenge by Captain Sparkles. Like single-handedly greatest Minecraft parody ever. Hey, what up, Jfire? Mwahahaha. <laughs> Welcome to the stream with your evil laugh. Welcome back, man. How's it going, buddy? Hope you're having a good day, man. Call me what you want, but you can't call me bro broke. Don't call me that. Chad, if you don't like lo-fi, you're probably really annoyed right now because I just like all I play anymore. I think we're just gonna have to go to general video game music though soon. You know, it is what it is. So each set of stairs should be one longer than the one above it. So then this one. This should be cornered right here. Okay. This is my feel out the design pattern, right? Remember chat, that's how we build here on this channel, right? We feel out the design. The design's already out there in the Minecraft. We just gotta feel it out and put it together. British biscuit equals hard tack. I don't think it does, British biscuit. Jfire is here, boys. I'm here, <laughs> I'm back. Welcome back, oh God. Making me nervous with those devil emojis. That was the latest evil laugh. Lamest evil laugh ever, redo it, me? I don't know, I can't really redo an evil laugh. An evil laugh requires a certain level of like deepness in your voice that if I'm being quite honest with you and blunt, I just don't have. Like it, is, it, is, it sounds bad. I think I'm just not a very evil person, chat. I'm a really nice guy, you know? And not in the like, I'm a nice guy, I deserve sex, <laughs> kind of, you know, those, those guys. The not actually nice guy, nice guy. I think like I'm an actually just a nice person. At least I try to be. And I feel like, you know, that's the best you can really do. Just try to be nice. At least try, chat. Better to try and fail at being nice than not even try at all. I don't think I'll ever in my entire life get good at getting stairs to actually place correctly. Like, I don't get it. it. They just do what they want to do. I'm just along for the ride. Mega Man! Do the laugh. I'm not doing the laugh. I'm already I'm already pre-embarrassed by it. Ah, 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 ah. No, see, it's bad. That's it. Yeah, I told you I was bad at it. And you made me do it anyways, chat. You pushed me out of my comfort zone. Ooh, free quartz block! Thanks to the glitch. All right, we'll take it. <laughs> it worked out in our favor for once. All right, so this should go here. I really need like one more layer of cobblestone here. Like, what do I aim for? The corner-ish, I guess? I guess, I don't know, chat. Maybe this is the pattern I wanted. Maybe I wanted stairs that were every other one were upside down. I didn't. You got me, chat. Spoilers, he didn't. Pop, 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 boom, design. Wow, chat, that's what I call architecture. It looks gorgeous. Like my face. Hmm, like your face, chat. Can I request some video game music? I got a dope playlist for that. Is it Persona 5? 
Uh, oh yeah, it never lets me open links from this page. Hold on, hold on. I had to do some. I gotta do some fancy maneuvering to be able to open links from chat. YouTube doesn't trust me to open links from chat. It breaks. It always breaks. It always breaks. Gorgeous. Yeah, that's my voice repeated on echo. Love it. Avocado. Wait, are the links showing for you? They're showing, but I can't click on them, but hold on. You have to try to be nice. It seems to come naturally. I mean, somewhat. What's up, Jennifer Arnold slash Ditto slash my lovely, beautiful friend? How is your day going? Hello, digital wave, digital dancing. That wasn't that fun. Guacamole, avocado. What happened? My mom called. I don't think anything significant happened. You like jazz? Best meme ever. Hashtag B movie. Okay, whatever. To the left. Wah, ah, ah, ah. Ah, I am the emperor. This is how I talk, because I am dumb, and George Lucas is not actually very good at making movies. <laughs> That's my impression of the emperor being breaking the fourth wall. My face is the... Uh, well, that is not how you spell equivalent to the Phantom of the Opera. With or without the mask? With the mask? Hot. Without the mask? Hotter. Abom Battlefield trailer? I mean, I do dig Mario music. Like before he crashed the streams. That's true. Oh my god, is this an N64 remix of uh. I wish I knew the words to this, it would make it a whole lot catchier. Wacky world. I don't know the words at all, but I wish I did. We'll just continue to improv. The stars, hey, I knew that word. My singing voice is so really great. Everybody loves it when I just continue to sing. That's why I'll never stop. <laughs> Chat, always remember, if you don't find me funny, I find me really funny, so it's never gonna stop. <laughs> I love improving songs, dude. Energy Drink Reviews, hello, I was hoping you can give me a shout out. I have a lot of subscribers. No, without the mask, I am the sexiest man alive. Let's hear it for Carter, sexiest man alive. Big claps in the chat. GG. <laughs> Big GG. Chat, don't forget to drop a like. If you liked, if you don't like, don't forget to suck my taint. I don't care. I don't know what you want me to say to that. Oh, I was watching your content and I didn't like it very much. Okay, don't watch it then. No. <laughs> like, what do you want? What do you want? I never get why people feel like the necessary, like, to leave a negative comment on YouTube videos, chat. Honestly, I don't think I've ever, like, left a negative comment. Okay, well, I may have at one point in my life or another been a little petty and mad and left a comment that was negative because someone left a negative comment to me but to be fair it was only in that specific scenario and i don't do it anymore i was much younger click the animal crossing one too oh dude i can't keep clicking all these links that's why i'll never stop is my new life song i do what i can chat i do what i can uh it's too much work for me to click a link. Why did the alligator try to solve a crime? Because he was an investigator. Banned. Ban this man. Nah, I'm just kidding. Nobody ban him. Oh, well. The only mod here is Kane, and Kane's the laziest mod in the world, so no real worries about being banned from him. Be your wanna, I'll be your wanna. I wish I knew the words. Oh yeah, those, oh I do want to put stairs there actually. That was a mistake, but then I realized that was actually correct. And like here and here, you want to make like this whole like, no, nah, not this one. Oh wait, yeah, no, that's what I want to do again. I remember how to make this pattern now. Stairs, 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 and then internal stairs. And then you run out of stairs, which is a problem for making this pattern work because I needed stairs. Okay, so I kind of also feel like, oh, but I have to leave this here because of this redstone block. Damn. 
Should have gone down one farther. Well, that's fine. It can start here, technically. No one up Well, that doesn't work. No. We have some other options to play with here. Yeah, it can work like this. Like I said, chat, feel out the pattern. This is it. Okay, so this is one, two, three, four over, and then it's gonna start filling in. That was a pretty good song. Okay, wait, so. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro. Then it goes over. Oh, yeah, and then I gotta, like, I gotta go in there and deal with that at some point. We'll get that all fixed later. Ba -dum -bum, ba -dum -bum 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 -bum. Chat, should I just like do improv streams? I think I should. I think that's what we all agreed upon here, right? We should just improv. Can I be your banner for an inappropriate viewer name? Is your name inappropriate? I didn't know your name was inappropriate. I mean, how is your name inappropriate? I, I don't know. These are all gonna basically get replaced with sports. Trying to conswer conswerve sports. What on earth is playing? What did you do to us, Kane? What a weird mashup. Why? Why mash those up? Why mash those up? I don't get it. That is bizarre. And links are devil. Kane, no, they're not. They are the most beautiful thing in the world. Trust me. Fine, I'll click on it. Cafe OST version Animal Crossing Wild World. Alright, fine. Only because it sounds jazzy and I dig it, man. Child chewer is mine, Jesus. Oh my god, what a mashup. Alright, fine. I'll just wait by the middle, man. I still don't know all the words. Da -da 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 oh wait, this is piano man. I do know some of these words. Day <laughs> this is piano man. The regular crowd shuffles in. <laughs> all just <laughs> oh god. They know the gear. Hey, Mr. Piano Man. Don't you play me a piano? Cause I love to listen to Piano Man. Piano Man, Piano Man, Piano Man. What was a Waterboy joke? I don't think I've ever seen Waterboy in its entirety. Only in its partiality. Alright chat, we only need 10,000 more quartz blocks to get this build finished. Great. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, what have I what have I done? Why did I think this would be a good idea chat? Why did I think an all-white quartz room would be a good idea? Because I'm an amazing builder. That's why and it is <laughs> It's an old man. Uh, it's a piano man. There's a man made out of pianos How does he go to the bathroom? When his hands are made out of keys No one really knows Except for his caretaker named Steve I don't know why I made 12, 21 of these 21 of these is what I chose to make When I needed 3 And I need every block of quartz available And I just blow them all on stairs that I don't need For no reason at all Alright Kane I'll admit that was sick I dig it no to ban someone, please. All right, 11 peeps, he boys. The boys, the campers, they're growing. Sunshine. Ooh, you know what would look cool? If I took this down one further, this would look sick, actually. Oh my God, what is playing now? No, what is playing now? What the hell? Da, da, da. Oh, 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 yeah. Oh, no, yeah. <laughs> this is the weirdest stream. What is happening to this stream? Oh, no, 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 no. Stop, stop. You cannot sing that on stream. Stop. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, we just got a copyright strike for sure. Thanks a lot, Kane. Thanks a lot, Kane. 
Uh, Kane's gonna get my whole channel taken down. The day of, of this, my cat's quinceanera. I search up shrine like you told me and now I'm questioning you. Wait, what shrine? I didn't tell you to look up any shrines. The man drinking his tonic and gin. This is water, bro. I don't start drinking until after the stream's over. People equal shit by Slipknot. It sounds relaxing, but uh, also sounds very copyrighted. Right, I guess it's better if I do this and then... How do I keep messing this up, Jet? Is it my fault? No, it's the children's fault. That's what I want. And then I'm thinking the whole floor goes down another level now. And then it'll be like this really sick elevated walkway all the way down. Cause it won't just be like a cool pattern in the floor. It'll actually be like elevated. And I think that is gonna look pretty dope. I'm being honest with you. And then this doesn't really need, well, this could be cobblestone actually, because this wall is just gonna get filled in too. I'm also gonna sprinkle some more gold in here. When were you sick? I was, I mean, my whole life, because I'm ill, yo. Clearly by the fact that I chose to do that out loud on stream in a public setting proves that that is not indeed true at all. But, <laughs> uh, I was sick last week from, I got sick, started feeling sick Wednesday night was the last day I streamed. I was pretty sick Thursday. Friday and Saturday and Sunday. Sunday I started feeling better. Bye, and you are an independent idiot. Thank you, I am very independent. Appreciate it. Be jealous. Be jealous of my 10 viewers. Bro, some people just can't handle it. They can't handle how awesome I am and they feel the need to lash out in irresponsible manners. It's okay, you know, I don't know how I would handle not being me, honestly. I mean, I am me, so I would probably handle it amazing. But if I wasn't me, it would be tough on me to not be me. Ooh, I just had another idea. I don't know if it would look good, though. I could knock these out and put in more stairs, and it would give it, like, this... Some stairs facing, like, up, and it would make, like, this pattern right here. That'd be cool. Maybe. When were you ill? Always. I was born ill. I don't know how we're gonna do lighting down here yet either. Maybe lanterns, maybe some glowstone blocks. Who knows? I don't know yet. Like I said, I gotta feel it out, man. Can't you give me a shout out? Cause I don't know you. You're probably one of Beeson's 18 accounts, in which case that's reason enough not to give you a shout out. Shrek is love, Shrek is life, correct. Yeah, that's what you told me to search up shrine when you were sick and playing. I don't think shrine is what I told you uh, to look up because I don't know what the hell shrine is. Maybe you misheard me. What is shrine? I don't know what shrine is. Why would I tell you to look up something I don't know? <gasps> Maybe so then you would look it up for me and then I would know. Hmm. That's possible. I definitely didn't tell you to look up shrine though. Oh, what did he what did he type? We got I'm still here. Lol GG. Who the fuck is B-san? Sounds like just like something one of B-san's alternate accounts would do. You get really tired of B-san's alternate accounts. It's really annoying to like... Not know whether or not you can engage with new viewers. I'm actually like really annoyed with it at this point. Really don't want it to keep continuing. Gonna have to start timing them out. Bison is a legend. Don't encourage this behavior. It's actually ruining my engagement with potentially new viewers, so it actually needs to stop. Bow, 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 bow. Boom. Alright, so, and this will just be stairs all the way down. So this block I wouldn't need to worry about, but I'll need to take the whole floor down like along this grid space. Back to the end of the vid now, I'm curious. I have no idea what you're talking about, so I'm curious too. Are we talking about the day 
Wait, was it Sunday? Are you talking about the day where I was streaming and I was sick? Are you talking about like right before I got sick? I guess you're probably talking about Sunday's video. The day I was sick and was streaming, like was starting to feel a lot better. What did I tell you to look up? I mean, it was probably a joke, chat. How do you not understand that 90% of what comes out of my mouth is a joke by now? Oh, snap. What? 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 Chat. Oh my god, chat. One of the movies I worked on is on YouTube. Chat, the movie I was talking about earlier with the lead actress who everyone was making fun of her, uh... Uh, her eyebrows? Apparently it's on YouTube. I'm gonna look it up right now. Chat. Some of the stuff I worked on last year is finally starting to come out, and that's great. For all the wrong reasons. Everyone is making fun of Jillian's eyebrows. Dude, you really gotta stop with all the different accounts, man. Like, I really, I, I don't, I can't engage with new viewers if I need to, and it's a problem. I need you to stop coming in here with 2017,000 different accounts. It's becoming an issue. All right, chat, we're gonna look up the movie that I worked on. Oh my God, I'm sorry, we gotta take a second here. Hold on, hold on. Chat, I'm so excited. Hold on. Let me move this to a different tab. Actually see you guys still. Bloop, bloop, bloop. The virus. Oh no. When you were streaming sick but feeling better. That was Sunday. Yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. Please uh, search that so my curiosity can be satisfied. Okay. Oh my god, this movie is on YouTube in its entirety. This isn't like an official upload. These are people, people do this? People just steal movies from Lifetime and then load them up onto uh, YouTube? Oh my God, it's on YouTube. I worked on this movie. I was, I worked on this movie. I, uh, I was the talent PA, which means I was in charge of helping with the talent. Talent was all pretty nice. Oh, it looks, or I shouldn't badmouth my bosses on, on it. We can't like listen to it, listen to it, because I think that'll it could risk getting us a copyright strike, like an actual copyright strike. So we can't really listen to it. I remember this, dude. Oh my god, Bison, stop with all the different accounts, man. You gotta, you can keep the ones you have, but you gotta stop making new accounts. I really, it is a problem for me to engage with new viewers because I'm just paranoid that all of them are you. And the joke has run its course, all right? It's been a couple weeks. Let's let's stop. I really need you to stop. <laughs> Chat. Oh my god, I know these people. Okay, so like this guy, can you see the cursor? This guy was uh he was a stand-in. He's a real nice guy. Uh this guy always works for the company I work with and drives the van and runs the town around. He's a nice guy. He's a cutie with a book. Dude, everybody's making fun of her eyebrows, is what I heard. Let's see if we can find some comments. Dude, we shouldn't be doing. Uh, I shouldn't. I should back up because it's gonna get me in trouble, dude. This is not what I want out there. But people liked it, dude. I was told that people were making fun of her eyebrows here. Great movie and upload. Besides the time, this is a good movie. Interesting movie. What a twist. Lovely movie. People love their lifetime movies. Just let a new comment on that video. What video? This video. Based on a true story? No, it wasn't. <laughs> it's a lie. That is a bold-faced lie, dude. Hell no, it was not, dude. You can't just lie like that. That is illegal. Oh my god, I want to skip around. Dude, we were on this farm for like, what, 12 days? No, 9 out of 12 days we spent on this farm in September and it was like 100 degrees every day. I don't know what video you want me to search, dude. I think you misheard me. This guy was super nice. She started off super nice and then kind of got a little needy at the end. She's super nice. Oh my god, is it their steamy sex scene that they added in at the last minute? And then they, like, refuse to do. He's super, super nice. Him and his partner just adopted a new baby. 
I'm gonna comment nice eyebrows. Do not, dude. Don't, don't, don't be mean, chat. Don't bully, chat. We'll see. Our, you know, the movie was shot really well. It looks good. We have a very talented team of cameramen and gaffers and lighters. Like, look at the movie. You can't tell me it wasn't lit well, dude. This house and this scene right here was a nightmare. Okay, so like, this house right here was um. It had one bathroom in the whole house, and it was the only bathroom we could use. All of our cars were like a mile away in crew parking, so we would have to get shuttled back and forth to this place. So if you had to use the bathroom, you had to use the one bathroom, and the bathroom was in the middle of set. Like, so when we were outside filming, it wasn't that bad. That was the second half of the day. The first half of the day, let's see if they go back inside. Okay, yeah, so this is the house, right? It's a kitchen. It's the kitchen. A living room, the bathroom is like right here to the left, and then an upstairs with no extra bathroom. Uh, and that's it, dude. It was horrible. Help, Aaron. What? Should I ban? Should you ban what? A comment? Yeah. Come on. I'm leaving. I'm going insane. That just don't know what vid I mean. I don't know what you're talking about, dude. You're, you're insane, man. You don't know what I'm talking about. All right, back to Minecraft. There we go. Uh, oops, I forgot to leave chat pulled up. Ah, oh, dude. Bruh, the caterpillar, the, uh, the uh, emoji you choose to use. Hurtful stuff, man. Real hurtful stuff. Oh yeah, just, just real hurtful stuff, you know. Maybe I should do the outer like level ring uh, with something else. Yeah, chat. Not a fun day on set when, like, the only bathroom is on set. Always a bad day. Always a real bad day. Honestly. Ooh, gravel. Gravel's easy to dig up. Yep. That's nuts, man. Oh, I can't believe people uploaded that movie to YouTube. I can't believe people are talking so much smack about that actress's eyebrows, too. I never They don't seem weird to me. I don't know she's got fine eyebrows. I think her eyebrows seem very normal. I mean, honestly, though, they do. do they, are they not normal? They seem normal, dude. It must be sad to be, like... A little kid so desperate for streamers attention I wish his parents would just like you know love him more is that too mean chat i can't help but make like incredibly mean jokes at people's expense when they come into my chat and make asses out of themselves you know it just feels like they're asking for it at that point but then i say something mean and i feel bad i don't want to be mean it's just that like I got these jokes in my head at people's expenses when they deserve it, and I can't not say them. It's kind of a problem. You know, if you're getting banned by Kane, you've uh, you done you done messed up, man. Seeing Kane enact those uh those duties as a moderator. Here's what I'm thinking. I want to build like a dome shape, kind of right. I think that'll be cool. I mean, this will eventually all be, all be replaced with a uh, what you call it. That's. Like how this would look. I think it would go in there, and it would be like that. No, oh, but that's not really it either, because it that's too like too diagonal. I've worked with a tier list. When's the people I've worked with tier list where we go over a bunch of movies that you worked on? What do you want? People I've worked with or like uh I, per I definitely should not do that as someone who works as a talent PA. That seems like career suicide, I gotta say. Seems like a pretty awful idea. It'll be like that more.
that's more the shape we're looking for. That's like that, and then it'll go in more. Oh no! But first, I guess we're gonna have to go outside and make that doable. It's gonna take some work. All right, that's a little bit. Kane speaks softly and carries a big wrench. <laughs> I guess that's how you want to call it. This is kind of going to be the general shape, general shape of the, uh, the structure here. Is that right? Um, <laughs> hello, torch. You, uh, you got something to say to me? Wow, this just keeps happening. No, didn't want to do that. Oh no, now you're flooding. Whoopsies. Whoopsies poopsies. I mean, it doesn't matter. All these blocks are going to get replaced eventually anyways, but uh, figure it out, you know. I think do this, this, this. I think it'll be shaped somewhat like this, and then it'll go down deeper. All right. But again, it'll be dome shaped, so like... It's probably like... Yeah. Loop. Um, hello, water. Go away. You have no right to be here, water. You have no spore, no spawn, no source. You are nothing. Oh no, help! My base is flooding. Whatever am I to do? Help me, Oprah Winfrey. Help me, Jesus. With your aid, I could succeed. I get over a freaking low-quality Adobe Illustrator sniper scope and when they could have just hired a guy to hold a sniper aim down to make the scene better? Nah, you can't. Ah, you're shooting a lens through a lens and it gets a lot more complicated. It's just cute. Don't know why everyone exaggerates the eyebrows. They're a bit bushy, but they're not like unkempt. I don't even think they like look bad. I think they look fine. People are crazy. I think people just see someone in a movie like that and they just honestly kind of get jealous and like, I think, and I, I think it's two things. It, it could be one that, you know, movie, people in movies are held to such ridiculously high standards that by normal people standards, she destroys all of us. She's way hotter than any of us could hope to be in real life. But because she's a movie star, people expect, like, so much more than that from her, you know? So, I mean, it could be something along that mentality. Uh, but it also could just be jealousy. You could just straight up be jealousy. People who... You know, they like to put down a celebrity like that because they think if they put down a celebrity like that... It makes them uh, feel more attractive about themselves. Like, oh, it's the celebrity has got flaws. You know, oh, you know, I, I may be a normal looking person, but I got better eyebrows than a celebrity. So that makes them feel good about themselves in some sad way. In which case, they should really not feel good about themselves because they're kind of just being a dick. If we're being honest. I mean, that's just my opinion on the matter, though. Yeah, I think this is uh, this is the shape. I think this is uh, that's it. We'll replace all of that eventually with uh, more quartz, and then we'll uh, we'll light it up or like I don't know. We'll do something fancy. It'll be a mix of like quartz or gold or um, or maybe even like some dark nether brick or something. Something cool. Maybe an obsidian. Maybe some black obsidian. That's where our ender dragon skull will go eventually. And maybe yes, potentially a fish tank as well. Maybe, uh, maybe we'll put a fish tank in there. But once we finish this room, it'll be this grand, like, uh, trophy room, you know? That'll be the point of this room. And then the Ender Dragon Skull will be the grand trophy at the end of the walkway here. 
and then we may submerge it into a fish tank so it's like behind the glass and behind the water it could look pretty cool it could look pretty cool i don't know thematically that it would really match up but uh it could look pretty grandiose at least we've got this initial part done i think i need to spice it up with some gold pattern but i'm not exactly sure what i'm gonna do in that regards yet something i don't know what all right back to looking for a looting sword I will eventually get a looting sword. What do we have? Let's get rid of this crap in our inventory, I guess, real quick. Yeah, we have so much junk. Why? Well, I just like refuse to throw any of it away. I'm a hoarder. First step of any problem is admitting that you have a problem. All right, what's the second step? I don't know. I never got that far. And that's why life is sad. A one man play by me. One man, one minute play. Of the face of a friendly bear. That sounds adorable. An unkept one. I know you're talking about there and have the face of a movie star. Shooting, yeah, yeah. Above or below the head. Chat, what's the most attractive 10% of your body? Go. Yeah, well, actually, I'm actually kind of curious on this regard. Chad, what would you say your best feature is? You're like your most attractive feature is. I think mine's probably my hair. I do, I do desperately need a haircut right now. All right, where are we digging out? Okay, so this is where we're like popping out. It's good to know. We got pretty far forward. If we had gone down more, how much farther down would we have had to have gone? Oh, extremely. Pretty much extremely. Oh, I left torches in there. Dude, that zombie through this filter looked like a regular Steve guy. I do want to go back in here at some point, too. So that we can, um... Probably start digging down to bedrock, if we're being honest. Digging that thing all the way down to bedrock is going to be a cool one. And then lots of glass. We've got a good stack of glass ready to go to get it. We could potentially have enough right now, actually. But we just need to do that outside perimeter, and it didn't take that long. How tie up are we? Right here? Hello? Um, we are... This is the Y value. 65 ups! And that already goes down, I think, about 30 blocks. So we really need another 30 so blocks down. Let's do it. Let's go ahead and do it right now. And why not, chat? We have the supplies, right? Yeah. Every piece of glass I own, and let's make this happen. Ooh, and magma blocks. Can't forget, I got a... Make the magma block tower extend all the way down too. Don't think I'll even need one full stack, but I'm taking two stacks just in case. My unbridled charismatic charm. Sure. Are we talking about things that don't exist? Oh no, your best quality. Yeah. <laughs> charm is a great quality, you know. Personality is a great quality. You know, if you're ugly, it's like the next best thing you could hope to have. Got him. Burn. Boom, roasted. Oh, I should check my sword first before I get too into any of this, though. Alright, before we get too into this, let's go up and see if we can get a good sword enchantment real quick. I'm level 42, baby! It's the answer to life, universe, and the everything. I can see that, Kane. Kane seems like a charming person. I can see Kane being a real charmer. You will give me the enchantment I want. Oh, you will give me the enchantment I want if it kills you. Punch one. What is punch? Uh, increases knockback dealt. Where'd it go? Just moved on me. Oh, it's the enchanted... It's a bow enchantment. That's a dome enchantment. So you're good, looks, great charm, and a touch of narcissism? Sounds about right. Wow. Whew. Baby. You best, uh, you best hide your women from Cain. I don't know why I went ahead and used that enchantment anyways. Ah, oh, we did it! Looting! 
Looting and sharpness. Well, I would have liked, um, I would have also liked unbreaking, but you know, that's a really great sword. So we'll take it. Hell yes. We got looting chat. Big pogs, big pogs chat. Actually, that's going to be a, it's going to be a, a GG man. Dun, 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 dun. Probably still not, not on on. Don't you mean oh I no punch him in? That's probably racist. Oh, cough cough. Cough okay. cough. So the goal here is gonna be like, is this gonna leak anywhere as I'm doing this? It's gonna leak. Oh no, wait, no, that block did not need to come up. Okay. I'm trying to think about what I'm trying to do here. I'm gonna extend this down for right now. That's all I'm looking to do here. Um, redeem poggers, redeem furries, <laughs> redeem furries. I don't think uh, I don't think redeeming the furries is gonna be that easy, my guy. If we're being honest here. <laughs> gonna be a little more complicated than that. Ugh. Jump! Jump! There we go. Ow! No! Damn it! Pushed me off. That is some rude ass gravel right there, man. First off, it's going to be redeem a woo. <laughs> and second off, it has not been programmed yet. Once we get this started, it'll be a lot easier. The goal is just to make this basically extend all the way down to uh, to bedrock. I think that'll be cool. Hopefully we'll run into like some caves or some lava along the way. Something that'll kind of give it, you know, an extra cool look. But uh, if nothing, I think the... Oh, there's an underwater cave. That's right. The uh, the look of the magma block disappearing into the ether should be pretty cool. Redeem a woo. It's not a thing yet. Not yet. Weren't you just complaining to me about how you didn't like a woo? And now he's a wooing. See, chat, they always come around to the awoo side. They always come around. My goal here is to leave this part open, and that will be my exit, is my thought. I already explored down here, right? There's, yeah, there's nothing. It's literally just a tiny little mini cave. Up here and here. A nice little building project. I don't like a woo, but I'll take all the points possible. Nice. <laughs> Gotta game the system, man. I like how you guys are so addicted to the points. It's great for my stream. Keep them coming back. Keep them watching. Keep them commenting. Keep them earning those points. So chat, there's, uh, we should find some other stuff to redeem points for besides just the gifts. I like the gifts and I want to do more of those too. But you know, technically I could do like anything. I could do a redeem that's like play one non-copyrighted song or like stuff like that, you know. Watch a watch a YouTube video 
non-copyright strike pending like that kind of stuff it would have to be like a lot we could do a lot of things man i was thinking we could just treat them more like how twitch is treating their points right now which is a lot of just like a lot of customization stuff can go on there all right we actually let's get rid of this we want this to be open you know we want to be able to see back here that's the whole point of this giant tunnel down to nowhere <laughs> is the fallout bioshock music a no-go um i don't know actually i'm not sure yeah that block will despawn eventually that's a good question fallout music probably yes bioshock music i don't know is that all is that real music or is some of that original to bioshock i mean if it's original to bioshock we're fine video game music is usually fine you know Uh, I don't know, man. That's a good question. Not one I readily have an answer for right now. I guess I would know when I looked it up, right? Because I would look it up and I'd be like, okay, no, this is copyrighted or not. You can usually tell by looking at the video. Redeem original Babe Ruth card. Uh, that's gonna take a lot of points. That's gonna have to be a lot of points because your points are worth zero dollars and zero cents per point and a Babe Ruth card is worth a lot more money than that. So, you know, not saying it's impossible, just saying you're gonna have to get like a billion points. That might actually be a billion point item. One billion points. I'm gonna go all Dr. Evil on him, baby. Wub, 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 wub. That in the wrong spot. Are you mad, Patrick? I can't see my forehead. I don't know why that popped in my head at that exact moment. So this is just always kind of close to being in my heart and in my brain by proxy. Spongebob gone, but never forgotten also not really gone It's real music. Uh, then probably not dude cuz I don't want to get copyright striked Sorry, bruh not uh, not getting my channel shut down over music Yes, play your spooky sounds Play that spooky music, white boy. Play those spooky tones in Minecraft. That's how we do it, chat. That's how we do it. Should probably leave like one layer exposed it'd probably make this a lot easier i should probably dig out the shape and then do the walls then it'll be harder to do the walls because i'm like I keep falling i can't just fall because there's like not just water to protect me all the way down i'll figure it out there's always a way just gotta figure it out like the best way to dig gravel it's probably not with a pickaxe all right also it is nighttime i could be out there hunting endermen what's the best way to find endermen now that i have the tools necessary what is the best way to actually go about finding the endermen how do you find spider-man need pictures of spider-man doing spider-man stuff all right j jonah jameson yo got it A. Jonah Jameson may have had a problem, an anger problem, but also some kind of sexual perversion problem with pictures of Spider-Man, because that man was really into pictures of Spider-Man. 
Weirdly so. I just was saying, I don't think a man who was not jerking off the Spider-Man pictures would want Spider-Man pictures that badly. That's just my theory. Hey, that's just a theory. A jerking off the Spider-Man pictures theory. Do you know that Persona 3 song that was used in Smash? Uh, vaguely. I have played Smash and I think probably heard it. I haven't played too much since the DLC started coming out. I played it a bunch when it was new. And then I just realized, like, I'm not going to be grinding this one out like I did with Melee. And then started playing it more casually, which just led to me not playing at all. Mostly my friends quit playing it. Which, you know, meant that I quit playing it too. Because I had no one to play with and the online sucks. Which was sad. Wish the online didn't suck. Wish Nintendo's online wasn't so bad. It wasn't so totally garbage. It, uh, I could have played a lot more Smash Bros. I could do a lot more on stream with Nintendo games too in that regard. There's definitely stuff online on the Switch that I would play. But oh well, you know, it is garbage and there's no change in that. That's the world we live in, boys. So they're one, nice. There's one little cave going down here now. And my life will certainly be easier if I keep this magma block kind of rolling as we go down. I don't want to like do too close because I don't want to get burned by it. But I feel like it matters too much. That's a nice costume, your boyfriend make it. Wow, Spider-Man, that sure is uh, pretty offensive of you. I love the Sam Raimi Spider-Mans though. Some of my favorite superhero movies in general to this day. Oh, that's right. I can't do that. Chat, I'm getting real hungry. I'm getting, like starving. What did I, I had a good lunch. I had the last night for dinner and I had the leftovers for lunch today. I had crispy fried tofu tossed in uh, garam masala spice. Also, I threw in some... Um, Cinnamon and some red cayenne pepper fried the tofu in a pan to get it a nice crispy outside baked it to really get the crisp to set in uh, Then cooked up a bunch of mixed vegetables and then served that over rice with sweet spicy um, Chili Thai sauce So good and then had some of the leftovers for lunch No, I cannot stand that noise like whatever noise. No, 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 no. Nope, can't stand it. But anyways, I'm getting kind of hungry, chat. How long have we been streaming? Two and a half hours? That's not a full length stream. Big one, you can't just get off after two and a half hours. We'll see. I don't know. I'm getting pretty hungry though. I feel like the brain starts to go a little soft as the hunger starts to set in. Yeah, what should I have for dinner tonight? Last night's dinner was a real winner. I gotta be honest. I was super happy. I was just kind of like throwing stuff together too. I'm trying to make more like vegan-y recipes and stuff. And I really, I'm liking the tofu. I liked seasoning it, seasoning it and frying it. I think gave it a really good consistency. It made it a lot better. I don't know what to do as much with, um... With like, I, I want to find more vegan dishes that aren't just like Asian dishes though. I, I love the Asian dishes, but I need some variety. I want to find some vegan dishes that are good that aren't just like tofu and vegetables with sauce over rice. Because that's really good, but like I got that. That's easy. All right. I've kind of figured out a good way to do that. I made tikka masala, which was all right. It, didn't, it was all right. It wasn't bad, but I didn't really win me over. I ended up not being able to finish a lot of it. I also made way too much of it because it's hard to make a good sized portion of it. Tofu is a great veggie protein. I love tofu. Baby, baby, baby. Is that what they're saying? That was my favorite scene as a kid when I had a macho man. And I mean, bonesa. <laughs> yeah, macho man, you mean bonesa. I love that scene as a kid too, dude. I love the whole intro scene. Eat on stream, Ninja does it. Look how he turned out. 
Yeah, but Ninja like buys food and like Uber Eats or has his wife cook it and bring it to him. I gotta go make food, chat. By the time I'm done cooking dinner, it's gonna be 30 minutes from now. That's the problem. I don't really want just like random loose torches. I need to like keep moving the torches down with us. Let's put the torches there on the ground and go. I also have an idea. Okay, wait, so this water is coming down right on this square. Oh, I see what's happening here. Um, that's true, dude. I'll just keep deep frying my tofu and pig lard. Dude, that honestly sounds delicious. <laughs> that straight up sounds delicious if we're being honest. Go look it up. Okay, can't escape this the this time at 156 on the video titled Sick, but still want to stream stream live on Sunday. I'm busy, dude. I can't stop and go look it up. What do you want from me? No, I'm not gonna go look it up. You just tell me what I said. You would have at least linked the video at the timestamp. I'm not gonna go stop the everything in the stream to go look it up. No. I'm streaming. What part of what part of this do, does nobody understand that I'm busy right now? Why is chat always so confused by the fact that like I'm busy? I'm streaming. You'd think that they would be the first to know. Okay, I'm trying to get the water to stop flowing everywhere. Instead, flow into the hole. Is there a drowned? I hear a drowned. Oh, there you are. Yeah, well, you're no worry of mine. Okay, great. So I'm thinking now I can take away some of these blocks and the water should just be going straight down, funneled into the hole. Fantastic. Go down a little deeper, even. In fact, I probably don't even need to make the hole this big. Yeah, I mean, technically, I just make it keep going down like. That'll buy us a little bit of peace and quiet time. Fall damage. Go look it up. Oh yeah. I'm probably going to spoil Uncle Ben on accident because sometimes when I'm sad, I just think Peter crying, looking down and saying Uncle Ben. I think everybody knows that Uncle Ben dies in Spider-Man. And if you don't, Uncle Ben dies in Spider-Man. Everybody has seen Spider-Man's origin story like a thousand times. So yeah. Pretty sure the, the statute of limitations on Spider-Man, the Sam Raimi trilogy, is certainly expired. You tried veggie wraps? You don't lift me up at all, but they taste alright. Well, that's good. Yo, I do like a fresh veggie wrap with hummus. Dude, fresh veggie wrap with uh, some hummus slathered on. He talking my language, man. Yeah, I, I do like those. That is the problem, though. That's the problem with like a lot of vegan food, right? It's like it just doesn't fill me up, dude. It's hard to get full on vegan food. Genuinely. I have kids. What? Uh, cereal is invented by Mesitanians and also the Aztecs across the world. Weird. I got some vanilla caramel tea with honey. Oh my god, it's so good. That sounds amazing. I want some. Oh my god. You ain't ready for the show. You ain't ready for the show. Moves. Show me your moves. Chat, show me your moves. What do you got, chat? Show me some moves, chat. Here's the pressure. Don't don't think, chat. Just show me your moves. Ready, go. Show me moves, chat. Show me moves. Quick, 
quick chat chat quick quick pressure pressure chat all the pressure perform show me moves where are the moves chat threw off my moves where this is corn and grains this is cereal oh, where there's corn and grains there is cereal cereal is delicious but I also don't really eat cereal anymore cereal not usually very healthy for you especially your uh, you know cereal offerings in America hard to get many uh, healthy cereal offerings in America even the quote-unquote healthy ones are not really that healthy Is this water coming from? Oh. <coughs> Pactology. Zek? No. <laughs> no. Sorry, man. Have you tried Elotas? No. What is that? I'm freaking starving. Thanks, guys. Dude, I know. You, you guys are not helping me with the not being hungry thing. Chad, if I was going to eat on stream, what would I even eat on stream, all right? Would I do that thing where they like hide their face cam and just play a YouTube video and continue to stream? Being a full-time streamer would be hard. I ate cereal with a fork? You are a monster. I reported to the police for being a monster. My god. I mean, this is not like a family-friendly stream, but it's like at least a PG-13 stream. You can't just come in here and say stuff like that. Okay, but here's my question, right? If you were to eat cereal with a fork, why even put milk in it at that point? Right? Because clearly you're just like, you're straining the milk out. That just seems like a waste of milk. Seems like you don't want milk then. Dude, also... Dude, uh, you know what my favorite cereal is these days as an adult? Honey Nut Cheerios with chocolate almond milk. Dude, chocolate almond milk on Honey Nut Cheerios is cheating. Or vanilla almond milk... But uh, add some extra honey to the Cheerios, like a nice little layer of honey on top, baby. Mmm. Delicious. Like, elite, criminally good. Go to jail, it's so good. You know how good you have to be to go to jail for being good? Really good. <laughs> Stupidly good. I love some veggie pizza. I love veggie pizza too, dude. Because I eat cereal with water. What? That's fair, I've actually heard some people do that. It's a little well, it's a little weird, but I can't knock it because I've never tried it. Blow your mind with this Mexican recipe? Do it, please. I love it, dude. Mayo vegan substitute? Ooh. Alright. Best Mexican street corn. Oh, I have had this! I have had this. Okay, shoot, I forgot that's what it's called. NA is great at Yo, dude, this sounds so good. Oh, I'm getting so hungry now, chat. Chat, you're not helping, dude. Buckaroo Bugbear. Yo, what up? Thanks for the bleep bloop. What happened? Did somebody subscribe? Thank you for subscribing, Buckaroo Bugbear, dude. Liked and subscribed, dude. Appreciate it so much, man. You subscribe to me? No. If that's the only reason you subscribe to me, I'll just tell you now. You can go ahead and unsubscribe. I don't do sub for sub, man. That's a really... You'll never, ever grow your channel with sub for sub. You're wasting your time. Grow your content by putting in lots of hard work and effort and perfecting your craft and, you know, having a passion for it. Don't try and grow your channel by going to people's live streams and asking them to sub for sub. General, genuinely friendly piece of advice. I'm just telling you, if you want results, you know, you're just going to end up with a, a ton of subscribers and no viewers. And that's not going to look great. Take it from someone who has that. To be fair, I got all my subscribers legitimately. I just, uh, I got them from making videos and then switched to streaming. So, they don't really watch this content as much. Milotas, baby. So good, dude. I should make those. There's some, like, I can think of, like, some good, like, uh... Ooh, there's, like, a uh, wasabi mayo that you can get from the Asian Isle. I don't know if it's vegan or not, but I think a lotus with, like, that wasabi mayo. I know that's, like, mixing cultural foods, but, uh... That sounds good. I mean, you don't have to say sorry, dude. I'm just telling you, I'm not gonna do it, and you'll be better off if you, uh... You don't do it either. You'll have better results, my friend. Be happier if you don't do that kind of thing. All right, this is going to be a problem here.
You ain't ready for the show. You ain't ready for the show. Everyone before we go on passes out from hunger exhaustion, drop it a like. Thank you for all the likes today, guys. That's not what I subscribed to. You. Okay, man. I mean, I hope. I just hope so. Sorry, I always use that as like a talking platform, you know? Don't take it too personally. It happens a lot, so I always like to spread my message of focusing on proper content. If you want, I will check out your channel after the stream's over. You know, if you want to self-promote, uh, we have self-promotional in a certain channel on our Discord. Now, if you want to get feedback from stuff. Maybe I should turn the small channel support or the self-promotion tab into a uh, feedback tab. I think that's what I'll do. I'm going to change the small, or not the small channel support. I'm going to change the um, self-promotion tab on my Discord into feedback. I think that's a good idea. Like, all my ideas are good ideas. Every time I try to go live, it says I have to have more subscribers. Mm, maybe just try streaming on Twitch, dude. Twitch is better for streaming anyways. And if you don't have an audience, I would really advise streaming on Twitch. The only reason I stream on YouTube is because I already had an audience on YouTube from making videos. So I started streaming on YouTube. If I had just started streaming only and wasn't like making, hadn't made YouTube videos, 100% I would be on Twitch and not YouTube. You tell me how to go live. I don't. I, I don't know, dude. I just go live. It's not. I've never. I don't know about this subscriber quota. I already had like 500 subscribers before I started streaming. Probably more than that. I like I said. I used to make videos long before I made um. That. I mean, they're just. Uh, I don't know, dude. Maybe look it up on uh, YouTube. I'm sure, someone's probably made videos on it. I'm sure, there are. People more helpful than I out there who could uh, give you knowledgeable advice. But, um, I would really just suggest going to Twitch if you want to stream. If you want to stream and you don't have an audience, Twitch isn't going to require you to have like a certain number of subscribers to go live. Twitch isn't going to say anything like, you know. Uh, and you might as well grow your audience on Twitch, right? Because then as you get bigger, it's easier to get affiliated on Twitch. It's crazy hard to get YouTube partner. I just got it myself, dude. You have to get a thousand subs and 4,000 hours of annual watch time. That's crazy. You do all that and the benefits aren't even as good as Twitch for streamers. Uh, you know, with Twitch, you just need one good month on Twitch and you can get your subscribe button. And if you get your subscribe button, then people can subscribe to you with Twitch Prime. And like people don't subscribe to people on YouTube with paid money, honestly. It just like doesn't it rarely happens. Like you're you're a million times better off. If your only goal is to stream, then I cannot recommend enough that you just go and do that on Twitch instead of YouTube. I've tried to make the transition over to Twitch. It's just really tough. Because my audience is here, and I'm basically like having to start over. That's like the only reason I stream on YouTube still. I'm trapped. <laughs> Go to their parent, Google. Google is the parent of YouTube. I have 106 subscribers. I've been on for a year and a month. You should definitely be able to go live with 106 subscribers, dude. I don't know. He would be on Mixer. He could be on Mixer. Don't play Fortnite because you'll get on bigger professionals in the game. Yeah. Only 12 years old. You should just be streaming for fun if you're 12. Stream to learn how to stream and stream to have fun. I had a lot of homework today. Best part about being an adult is no homework, and I think almost every adult will agree with me there. Anybody who is out of high school, can we just agree that the best part of our adult lives is that we don't have homework? Like, literally, that may be the best part of being an adult. That and, like, I have my own money, I have my own place, like, I have no bedtime. Honestly, when I've never understood the mentality of, like, I want to be a kid again. I Look, there's a lot of great stuff about being a kid, and you should enjoy it while it lasts, because there are certain aspects of it that you won't get to enjoy anymore as an adult. But in general, would I go back? Hell to the no, 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 I would not. How far down do I need to go still? How far down am I right now? I'm at 22. We're pretty far down, actually. We're actually most of the way down. Oh, 
I've had multiple dollars on Twitch. I haven't made a single dollar on YouTube. I mean, I've made money from donations, but that's fulfilled through Streamlabs and given to me directly by my viewers. You know, that has nothing to do with YouTube. Pretty soon, I will be able to turn on monetization and super chats, which is like donating through chats and uh, hopefully paid subscribers. I'm not sure that's a whole different beast of a program to get into, but technically as a gaming channel, we should be allowed to uh, be a part of uh, the YouTube like super membership paid BS thing. I always have homework when I'm off work, but it's not paper or homework. It's mental work. Oof. Are you Christian? Uh, no, I would not identify as such. But I don't ever talk bad about religion. I don't really try to talk religion, period. But my general philosophy is that while I am not particularly religious in any way, I don't knock people who are and support people's right to, uh... Is this my strip mine? It is! <laughs> it's, well, not my strip mine, but it's a cave I've already explored. That's funny, dude. Bro, I've been here before. <laughs> you know, I, I support any belief system that gives people a moral compass and allows them to be a better person. And if that's what Christianity is for you, then I all the more support you for it. Deep and somewhat strange question for a 12 year old. Hey, you know. All right, whatever. We'll get to that in a second. <laughs> All right, there we go. Now we got the water under control. Should make the rest of this a lot easier. And we know we're super close to bedrock, which makes life a lot better too. Oof, I gotta stop doing that though. So much garbage in my inventory. The gospel says it is greater than religion. Why not, what do you mean? What do you mean by that? The gospel, like the word of the gospel is greater than religion? I don't want to talk about religion, man. I'm going to have to steer clear of that. Heard super chats are worse because YouTube takes 50%. Ugh. Is there anything that YouTube does that doesn't suck? I got to get back into restreaming. What up, Quite Gun Jin? What's up, side cartridge under your secondary account? Quiet Gun Jin. Quiet Gun Jin. Friend, it's not b -Song. That one's actually used cartridge. Trying to get a job at Subway. Why do people hate teens at their workplace? Because most teens are really bad employees. But the truth is that it's not because they're teens. It's just because most people are really bad employees. Although somewhat it is them teens. I worked with a lot of teens when I worked in food. And I, you know, I realized as time went on that like initially it was like, ah, I hate working with the teenagers. And then I just kind of realized that, I mean, A, you just treat them like a normal people because they are and adults, which they pretty much are too. And you know, you'll A, get better results out of them on average and B, the ones that you don't get better results on, it has really nothing to do with them being a teenager. They're just gonna be bad employees forever because some people just suck. <laughs> you heard of Talos? Do you know Christian is like God and how many Jesus? Dude, if you don't stop talking about Jesus, I'm gonna have to time you out, man. I've already told you I don't wanna talk about religion. All right, that's gonna be your last warning. Religion is not a, a proper subject matter. Yes, I have gone through confirmation i've read the bible i've studied the bible i've taken all sorts of advanced religious studies classes i probably know more about it than you do if i was gonna get into it i you know when i say these things i come from a point of knowledge when christians adopt their beliefs stop talking about religion chat we're gonna stop talking about religion i love teens in my workplace that sounds wrong that sounds very wrong Dude, getting my first job was so difficult, dude. Good luck to you, man. I really wanted to work. I filled out applications for every crappy little fast food joint across the entirety of my town. Uh, and it was so hard to get hired, dude. I only got a job eventually because of a friend. Actually, I've gotten a lot of jobs in my life because of friends. I got my job after that because of another friend, too. I had that job for a long time. I got all of my hotel jobs because of me. 
My hotel jobs, I never got a single one of them because of a recommendation. Those were all purely me being a really good interviewer. But all of my food jobs were recommendations, which is weird, because, like, it's not hard to get into food. It's not like the competition for getting into food is that difficult. Praise the goddess of love and compassion, Mara. You watch yourself. Spilled my tea. No, it sounded so delicious. Hold on. Moment of silence for your tea. All right, back to it. It's It was weird to me how hard it was to get my first job. It's still weird to me to this day to think back and like, why was it so hard to just get somebody to hire me? I wanted to work, you know? I wanted the job. I, I was a hard worker. I guess it's just because it comes down to like the, oh, you have no experience. We don't want to take a risk on someone with no experience, but that's dumb. I mean, like, someone's got to give you your first job. And then, like, and now in film, though, I'm completely relying on other, like, friends to give me jobs and work. Bella is also misunderstood as the goddess of lust, but she has been slanted through burial history and places. What religion are you talking about? We can talk about Greek mythology. I do like Greek mythology. Chat, I was really obsessed with Greek mythology. Chat, what's better, Greek or Norse mythology? I always liked Greek, but I never really got to study Norse mythology too, so maybe I don't get to, maybe I'm not speaking from like a, you know, well-educated enough aspect. Would be, could be the case, chat. What is everyone's favorite fruit or vegetable? Do we have to have this conversation every day now? Chat, do we gotta talk about everybody's favorite fruit and vegetable every single day that I stream now? No, I left, okay, I left two torches up there. Let's see if this will work. Can I shoot the torch down? No, you cannot. Now there is an arrow up there as well. <laughs> Stop talking about it. The last sentence, I think that you should go to church for one Sunday to listen to two Christian songs. You don't have to just sing. I still got to sing. Dude, I went to church four years. I probably know more about a religion than I would say any 12 year old does. I appreciate that you think Christianity makes you a better person, and maybe it does genuinely make you a better person. It's, uh, there, you know, I have my very deep personal reasons that, you know, probably a little mature and a little deep to get into on stream for why I don't. But trust me, I've read the Bible in its entirety. I have also studied religion. I've gone through confirmation, you know. I've been to church many, 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 many Sundays in my life. And Wednesdays and holidays. No. I don't knock religion. I don't talk poorly about religion. It's just not for me. This is Elder Scrolls religion. Alright, fine, I'll give it a pass. Chat, which game has the best religion, actually? That's a good question. I can see Elder Scrolls probably having the one of the best, like most fleshed out religions. Definitely one of the most fleshed out for sure. Some Christian music has bangers. Eh, I don't know about that. <laughs> maybe. I mean, I don't know. Maybe. Oh, chat. We will eventually be at Bedrock. I use... Okay, how do I keep switching this off in my inventory? It needs to stay there. Wait, Wednesday? Wednesdays? <laughs> Man. First of all, let me give you a little tip for life that helped me a lot. As someone who used to be a pretty bad speller and now is just a moderately bad speller. Wednesday is Wednesday. Day. That's how you remember it. It's the Wednesday. Day. W-E-D-N-E-S Day. Second of all... Um... Uh, sometimes you go to church on Wednesday during Easter season. See, this is what I'm talking about. I know more about true religion than you do. <laughs> In certain denominations of Christianity, you go to uh, church on Wednesday, typically through the Easter season, you go through Wednesday church. And sometimes for like the six to nine weeks leading up to um, e uh, Christmas, you will also go to church on Wednesdays. Every Sunday, I think you were thinking Catholics. No, I was Lutheran. 
It's not just Catholics. It's Catholics and Lutherans and certain other denominations of Christianity. I mean, Catholics are Christians too, you know. There's a there's about a hundred different flavors of Christianity. I love Greek. It started in fifth grade with Rick Riordan's books. What are Rick Riordan's books? Were those those books that take the uh, the myths and like retell them in like kid friendly ways? Those were always fun. Pajamas are better than shorts. Hell yeah, I'm wearing pajamas right now, chat. They're Game of Thrones pajamas. I bought them before the last season in my defense. Goodbye, buddy. Take care. Have to go. My friend is calling. Nice talk. Good talk, man. Have a great night, dude. Hope you have a good... You deserve it, man. Have a great night. We're going to stop talking about religion. That's why I had to bring up fruits and veggies. Okay. I just get baited so easily. The day you marry your Nintendo Entertainment System, wed nest day. Okay, that's brilliant, Kane. I love that. I wish I had known that as a kid. My cats. Welcome back, my cats. How are you doing today? Why are we talking about pajamas being better than shorts? They definitely are, though. I fell in love with a Mormon girl before. Nice. Kane, do you fall in love really easily? I feel like I fall in love way too easily. And by feel that way, I mean I know 100% for a fact that I instantly fall in love. And that is a problem. Because I also only am attracted to, like, people who... Uh, just relationships that probably wouldn't work out because the other person's not really that interested in me. And something about a person that's not really that interested in me just really gets me going. I'm gonna go cry now, chat. It's the heart wants what it can't have is a very, very true statement. I don't know why we're programmed to be so dumb. Why are humans so dumb? Like I dug a little too deep, I can't. There we go. Can't reach it anymore. Kind of a problem. That's the Brooklyn Nine Nine theme song. Such a good show. So glad it's back. Yes, Jake and Amy are gonna have a kid because the actress is already pregnant, and they've already like immediately launched into the like pregnant uh storyline pretty full force at the top of this season it's definitely like she's that like very obviously pregnant right now too and they're like trying to hide it like it's so much more obvious because they're trying to hide it which is the funny part about it you know like like it's very clear that the show is like giving her excuses to wear like outfits and be presented in situations where she can be pregnant and it's not a big deal and it, I just always laugh when sitcoms do that because it's like it just becomes a million times more obvious that that actress is pregnant. But like, what else are they going to do? I guess, you know, like, I don't know. Kind of a catch 22 situation. 1v1 me, uh, I win in Lego PvP. Lego PvP? What is Lego PvP? Not a thing. And then I saw her face. And now I'm a believer. I believe, I believe, I believe, I believe, I believe. Oh, it's Book of the Night Night is Terry Crews, and I love Terry Crews. Dude, how can you not love Terry Crews? Because it's true. All right, fair enough, gamer. I can't argue with you, girl. Percy Jackson was Rick Riordan. Oh, I never got to read those. Those were like a little after my time, unfortunately. They always looked interesting, though. Because it lets my twins breathe easier. Girl, you need comfier pajamas. My pajamas are not constricting any twins. I'm scared of cats, but uh, love animals. I love cats and animals and pets. I just really, really love animals, man. My mom was a vet, so I got to go around all, around all sorts of cats and dogs and things. I have never identified with either party, but I can't tell you that forbidden fruit tastes like ass. Is that is ass the forbidden fruit? Minecraft PvP is Lego PvP. Okay, okay, that's fair. I can see that. People legit don't like me for being scared of cats. Yeah, I mean, I gotta be honest, when you said that to me just now, my initial reaction was kind of like, wow, what an asshole. <laughs> so, chat, we're gonna be a little short on glass. We had almost enough glass to do this project. Almost. I guess we could finish digging it out while we're down here, though. Some dirt, man. 
Oh, just swim our way back up. I don't have any more glass at all. That was literally like the rest of the glass I own, dude. Cats are life. Look, I will always, till my dying day, prefer dogs. But I love cats a lot. See, I hate when people say that too and they're like, You don't like cats? Not what I said. Not even remotely close to what I just said. I love cats. I grew up, we always had four cats at a time when I was growing up. One would pass away, we would get another one. My mom was a vet, so we'd always end up with the adorable reject cats that no one else would want. Cats with like, cats who couldn't walk straight. Cats who looked funny. Cats who were mama cats and no one wanted to adopt. Older cats. You know, weird looking cats. All sorts of cats, baby. I sound like the play cats right now and I hate it. But, uh... You know, I always love them, but I just like dogs better, man. But my goal, my idea of like a, you know, the household I'd want to have eventually when I get settled down, i.e. marry someone who will take care of my dogs while I'm off traveling making movies. Um, <laughs> I can never marry someone else in the movie industry because one of us has got to stay home and take care of the dogs. All right, that's, I'm just going to have to marry outside of the movie industry. It's going to have to happen. But, um... Is that I, I would love to have two cats and a dog or maybe two dogs and one cat But definitely three pets total maybe two cats and two dogs But no more definitely no more than two cats because I've seen what that's like growing up and it sucks It's too many cats. It's too many cats. All right two is a great number of cats Or like a cat and a dog or two dogs and a cat or two cats and a dog But no more than two cats ever never ever have more than two cats chat. That's my life advice to you I don't want to go too deep because then I won't be able to reach it. Dogs are needy. just like little children. Cats will pretty much take care of themselves. What's wrong with your pet needing you? I want my pet to need me. That's the whole point. I want my pet to need me. I don't want some smug asshole cat who thinks he's better than me. I mean, I do. But like, I want to even it out with a dog that loves me at least. I don't know. I like how dogs are needy. I like how dogs are always excited to see you and always love you and always ready to go play and just like always pumped to go party, dude. Dogs are always ready to party. I adopted my mom's cat when she passed. This cat to be over 15 now and I've had her over five years. There's a gold digger female acting all sweet and waiting to pounce. Yup. Dogs aren't needy. Puppies are needy. That's also true. Real... Full grown dogs aren't really that needy. Terry Crews is that guy you see and are scared of, but then he talks about Axe Body Spray and makes jokes. Terry Crews is one of the nicest and sweetest people in Hollywood, dude. So it's grown into me to stay away. That's fair. If you're allergic, that's fair. Allergies is a great reason. Dogs need an immense amount of attention. Again, puppies more than dogs. As dogs get older, it's not really the case as much. Should know I have one. Older dogs don't really need that much attention. Definitely more than cats still, but not not anywhere near compared to when they're like younger than two One time as a child I put my brother's cat in a pillowcase to get him out of the room and didn't realize how messed up it was And the biological mom was like, what are you doing? Probably thought I was trying to torture the cat. She probably did I don't I don't mind that dogs need a, an immense amount of attention I mean really you're saying it like it's a bad thing, but to me. I'm like hell. Yeah, that's exactly what I want an animal that loves me for me and wants to keep loving me for me. Probably go down about one more layer safely for now. Me too. Yeah, I can still reach that. Oh my god, is there a cave nearby? Oh no, <laughs> I'm so surprised. Alright, this is the last layer we're gonna dig for now. We're gonna have to go get some more glass to finish this project. Alright, pretty nice. Good start for now. And by good start, I mean we got like, you know, 80% of the way done on this build. I think that's pretty good. Don't want to forget to do my lava. All right, Chet. Uh, it's probably one of the most messed up things I did as a child, along with breaking my sister's arm. Man, you broke your sister's arm? That's tough, dude. My eight-year-old dog died this summer from getting out and being hit by a car. Yeah, I think you told me that earlier, man. I'm a little sorry to hear that, though. That's really rough. 
I remember losing my first dog. It's it's a really tough experience, man. Why am I picking up all this cobblestone? Why do I always pick up garbage, chat? What is it about me that hoards these garbage blocks? I wonder if I could find my way back to my lake. Entrance from here. Probably shouldn't go too far and get lost. I remember this. Oh, I remember this. This is that underwater cave I explored. And then the exit was like here. I remember correctly. It's like water. Yeah, there it is. Neat. I think he did. Yeah, that sounds familiar. Sounds like the kind of story you don't forget. It's pretty sure. Yeah, that's the water. I'm sure the exit is like. Here's the exit. It's down more. Try to hear about your boat. Yeah, dude, that's rough, man. Yeah, there it is. Some Koran wrap in Scotch page. <laughs> Had to redo all of this. Okay. Hey, we made it back. Look at that. Great stuff, chat. Great stuff. Let's go for a little snappy nap. Uh, you know, we all do messed up stuff as a kid. It's just part of being a kid. You do dumb, messed up stuff a lot of the time, and uh, you learn not to do that as an adult. That's the learning process of it all. Yeah, all right, fine. I'll fill up this chest with cobble. Wow, this chest is almost full of cobblestone, too. Chad, I think two full chests of cobblestone means it's time to just start burning the stuff, all right? Uh, it's time to give up on collecting more cobblestone. The rest of this is going in the garbage. Now, one block at a time. I removed my pickaxe this time so that there would be no accidental ability to, like, throw away any very valuable pickaxes, alright? Never making that mistake again in my life. Do about him, you named your Minecraft dog Joey after him. Yep. I need to put a name tag on them for to make it official. Two full stacks didn't make it into the lava. All right, chat. There we did. I threw away some garbage, chat. Are you proud of me? I'm proud of me. I forgot to put my books back. Oh, now they're going to be all waterlogged. Darn. That's a big rip. Chad, I'm pretty excited. I'm going to watch Honey Boy tonight. It's finally out on uh, Amazon Prime. If you're going to go there often, I'd recommend putting signs or arrows or torches of where to go. What, down to my strip mine thing? Nah. Nah, I don't need to go down there again. Need sand, man. Sand, man. I <laughs> get it. I just got it. Sand, man. It's funny because it's sand, man. Chat sometimes I just impress even myself. Alright, so we still need like a billion blocks of quartz. That is for sure. I then need to start a whole thing that's just nether brick. Well, I guess I could just go ahead and turn the brick into uh, blocks. I mean, there's like nothing else that I would use nether rack for that's like, or not but turning into bricks, right? What happened to him anyways? He's right up here. He's right here. I just, you know, I just don't like to take him with me because then they die way too easily. And I don't want him to die. Yep, okay, this is getting pretty full too. Alright, it's gonna be time to start putting some of these finished slabs in, a, in another place. Time for a little more organization, you know what I mean? Stone, 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 stone. Give me Roger Stone. Supposedly great documentary. Do I have any empty chests? I do.
Organization is a never-ending battle in Minecraft. It's like a huge part of this game, honestly. Um, won't be too much harder to get enough glass to finish this, but it's going to take a little bit of time. Plenty of coal. Nice to get a little extra coal. Dirt, sand. Oh, well, there's some more glass right here. There you go. Boom, baby. Six blocks. Six more blocks towards the eventual completion. I drop that flint. Where's there a zombie? Oh, he's out in the water. Well, not for long, he's not. He's about to be super dead. I think Wiggy has a biggie heart. Uh, yeah, I do. My whole family does. It's a real medical condition. I think it's genetics. You know, a lot of heart disease in my family. Where are you, bro? I can hear you. I want to put you out of your misery. And by your misery, I mean my misery. Bro, don't pretend like you're not skulking around here somewhere. Hmm. Hey, when zombies pretend like they're not skulking around when they are distinctly skulking around. What's your opinion on anti-symmetrics? Symmetric, symmetrical building is great and being anti-symmetrical is dumb. I can understand embracing the occasional non-symmetrical build, but to be totally anti-symmetrical is narrow-sighted and dumb. That's right, Chad. I said it. I said it. I said it, chat. And chat, we're at three hours and 20 minutes into the stream. We're rocking eight viewers. I'm gonna have to start streaming for longer, I guess. I'm gonna have to start doing like four hours, five hour streams. Maybe I should stream twice a day. I just feel like whenever I stream twice a day, it just kind of devolves into the same thing, which is like, kind of just cuts into viewership more than it helps. But, you know, I do watch a lot of daytime streaming on Twitch. I could be spending that time actually streaming instead of watching other people stream. And I could get more Isaac time in that way. And I think that's really, like, the number one argument here is if I stream during the day, that's more time to play Isaac and Minecraft in the same days. And ROM hacks, honestly. Maybe make ROM hacks, like, a morning thing and, like, my Isaac in the evening? Or just trade off Minecraft and Isaac back and forth. 24 hour stream, let's go. Maybe. We're kind of getting closer to a point of justifying it. Maybe we start with like a 12 hour stream. Maybe we stream from like noon to midnight one day and see how that goes. I mean, you forget, I've done nine hour streams and both of them ended up being kind of small. But I could just do like nine hour or 12 hours of Minecraft and Isaac. Pick 12 hours of something popular and let's go with that. We could start with uh, start with Isaac. Do some uh, do some Minecraft. That's probably enough. Why do I hear skeletons in the daytime? Are you hiding in the shade? Thank you for subscribing. Hey, thank you Jeronis for subscribing. If you are indeed here and not just watching a video who happened to be subscribing at the exact moment. Either way, thank you. Okay, what other enchantment do I have on this sword? Sharpness. Okay, see, like, so they drop more loot now. I just killed two of them, but got four bones instead of two bones. It's pretty cool. Welcome. Oh, you are here. Dude, thanks so much for the support, dude. Appreciate it. I am getting some new viewers tonight on Minecraft. That's nice. Starting to get out of the bubble, dude. Could you spend that time watching wrestling videos? Thanks for the sub, b -son. Calm down. Not everybody is b -son. I hope. Number eight, sign of OCD symmetrics. I think I am a little OCD, to be honest. I wouldn't, I don't know, like, not so much to be like OCD, OCD, but like, I have, not not just like, oh my God, guys, I'm so OCD. I, I just, that, but like, genuinely, like, if I'm sitting around at a table, I cannot help but like fiddle with stuff on the table. And by fiddle with stuff on the table, I mean like organize it in a really weird way. <laughs> Like, I will, if I'm bored and sitting at a table, I will, like, start, like, cornering everything, like, cornering books with other books and, like, moving stuff and organizing it and constantly, like, tidying stuff up. 
I really don't like have OCD, but I think I might actually be like mildly OCD in a genuine fashion. I am here, but maybe not for much longer. Depends. Depends on what. The stream is probably going to end pretty soon, so I could tell you it doesn't really depend. Depends on whether or not I'm going to keep streaming, and the answer is it's probably about dinner time. And I have autism. All right. You have OCD tendencies? I certainly do. But you know, I don't, I don't think it's a detriment too much. I don't think it negatively impacts my life. I'm very lucky, I guess. I, it could be worse. It could be way worse. I think you've had at least three new viewers since the ninth like hit. Come on, guys. There's at least one of you reading this that has not hit the like button. Thank you, Trevor. Keep pressing them, Trevor. I like it. But I need to cook these things. These things need to get cooked. Ooh, more sand. Need a couple more shovels. Minecraft's such a great game, dude. I just never get tired of Minecraft. And I just almost hit the wrong button and made like 40 shovels. <laughs> that would have been not great. I've done that before. It kind of hurts, man. Okay, liked. Appreciate it, dude. Number four, number die of OCD, and then you hit your verbal response. <laughs> I certainly have tendencies. Look, no one's denying it, all right? 11 likes. Boom. 11? Nice. This is 10 on my stream. I always notice that on your stream, Kane. Could always be worse. Well, someone took away their like. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Could always be worse. That's right. It could always be worse. That's a good mentality to have. I always just figure, you know, I'm physically healthy and able, mentally healthy and able. I'm glad. Like I said, I don't know. I I'm glad that I'm not like full blown OCD to the point where it's like crippling. I mean, I'm not OCD at all is what I should say. I maybe have some tendencies. I mean, honestly, that's like the best of the world. I feel like though you get kind of lucky because you don't suffer from the negatives, but I'm pretty neat and organized because of it. It helps and that helps me in like schoolwork and stuff you know when I did go to school you know in academic works and stuff that sense of organization is really strong my stream says nine likes it keeps going up and down I think somebody is trying to toy with my emotions <laughs> toying with my emotions I'm in a glass case of emotion <laughs> Alternatively, we would have accepted Lisa. You're tearing me apart. Ooh, that could be a good redeem. That could be a really great redeem. You're tearing me apart, Lisa. Someone did take their like away. What the fuck? I don't know, dude. Someone's toying with my emotions. Don't they know that I'm emotionally vulnerable? I wear my heart on my sleeve. OCD is not a bad thing. OCD is a really bad thing. OCD tendencies cannot be a bad thing. OCD tendencies can be a very strong point in your life if you can use them positively. That's why I don't like when people say like, oh my god, I have OCD. I'm so OCD. Real OCD is like scrubbing your hands until they bleed or not being able to leave the house because you have to turn on and off the light switch 15,000 times or, you know, being late to your, uh, being late to your, uh, your own wedding or I don't, I don't know, you know, your daughter's your daughter's school performance because you uh, you have a routine that takes 55 minutes uh, to get out of the house and if you don't perform it perfectly then you um, you have to start over from scratch. That's real OCD. Hello, name I cannot pronounce at all. Nice name, do you know what their name says, Kane? I was also super unorganized but still an A student. You don't have to be organized to be an A student. That's definitely not what I'm trying to imply. That sounds legit, yeah. Super legit, but uh, what we're talking about, yeah, real OCD is an actual mental illness, and I think you know, as much as mental illness in general in this country does not get treated with the respect it deserves, I think OCD in particular is uh, it's not necessarily people's fault, they've just been lied to about like what OCD means. Been made the butt of a lot of jokes, but it's actually pretty crippling. So yeah, I'm glad I don't have it. I, I think always a great one to watch is like, uh, there's an episode of Scrubs with a doctor, Dr. Kevin Casey. Dr. Kevin Casey. Uh, 
tackles like the OCD a bit and gets really into like how it affects his life and like how he's been able to harness it for a positive but even while doing that it's still like really crippling to his day-to-day -day life it's a really really great couple of episodes that tackle that same with autism yeah you know like I think that people are like somewhat have this idea that autism is like this disease that makes you a little quirky and but uh you could be a super genius too you know uh whereas you know it's a huge spectrum of different things and i i don't know i've always thought that abed from community was probably one of the best representations of it in in film and media the idea that you're just like kind of a lovable weirdo with a super brain behind you is like you know it's not it's not great it sets up unrealistic expectations. You really want me to type OCD tendencies each time? I think we know the difference. Okay. I mean, you could type OCD T. OCD 10. Be true OCD is intended. I'm just saying. I'm just using it as a logic point. Not trying to call anybody out. Chat, in general, when I go off on a rant, I'm not usually calling anybody out in particular. I just like to use them as talking points to launch off of in streams. I know sometimes it comes off like I'm targeting something you said, but really... You know, I just like to use chat as a as a launching off point to have a discussion about things. Maybe things that maybe I shouldn't talk about because maybe I'm not knowledgeable enough. But I think if you try to have a generally positive message of awareness, you know, I don't think that you can really do a lot of harm. When, you, when your general message is, you know, get informed, stay informed, and listen to those people, I feel like you're pretty fine. I've, like, harvested so much sand off of this sand block. Like, all of the glass for the entirety of that tunnel have been come off of this hill right here. Express yourself as you want. I have a cousin with severe autism. An ability to express, but also to comprehend as well. A lot of uh, what autism is, is an inability to understand social signs. So it's not even just your lack of being able to express, but also your lack of being able to properly interpret. You know, a lot of times, some people with autism, you know, depending on their functionality, can learn to uh, interpret it, but it, it's like a learning thing, you know? It's not really a true understanding, it's like a learn to look out for these cues, these cues mean these things kind of thing. It's not like a... It doesn't become a true empathetic response, you know? It becomes a learned uh, response of looking for things. Debate me, Aaron? About what? What do you want to debate me about, Kane? Why angel deals suck and you're a real scrub of a player? Is that an enchanted fishing rod? No, he didn't drop it! Give it to me! I want it! This... Right here. This guy straight up just didn't even give it to me. He had an enchanted fishing rod and he didn't give it to me. We shouldn't be wasting any of our looting sword. Chad, should I make an enchanted diamond shovel? <laughs> it seems like a waste of diamond and enchantment levels, but honestly, at this point, who cares? I got the sword I want. I got the pickaxe I want. I got the armor I want. I mean, might as well just make an enchanted shovel, I guess. Maybe I could get a shovel with looting. What good in, uh, what good ones can uh, you get with a shovel? Are there any good shovel enchantments? About ASD? No, I'm not going to debate you about ASD. I don't know enough about it. Uh, I don't know enough about it to debate you. I don't know what I would be debating and what would even be the debate? Are we like for or against? Uh, what? <laughs> what does that even mean, Kane? Kane's a weirdo. A lovable weirdo. But a weirdo. Better to be a lovable weirdo than a not lovable weirdo. There's a lot of difference between those two. Lovable weirdo? great you know uh, everybody loves a lovable weirdo that's like a that's like you're a character in a disney movie right lovable weirdo everybody loves him but he's weird and then like some music plays and it's like da 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 and like that's like that's a lovable weirdo you get like some theme music and it's great more realistically to our real life situation uh weirdo probably probably not great probably some kind of sexual weirdo if we're being honest <laughs> take that L. Wow. What L? What L did I take? I'm impressed with your understanding, my friend. You sound like you know more about psychology than I do, so bows. 
I just try to be aware. It's really easy, chat. Here's what you do if you want to be more aware. When somebody from that group says something, you listen to what they say over any preconceived notions you may have. If somebody who is part of whatever minority that you're forming opinions of says a thing, you just take them at face value and try to understand their point of view, you know? It's like that old adage where it's like, you know, the, the two wolves are talking and the two wolves are like, Mr. Mouse said that Mr. Owl was crazy and trying to murder him. And then the other wolf says, well, that's absurd because I know Mr. Owl and Mr. Owl has never tried to murder me. So clearly Mr. Mouse is incorrect. I always come back to that. I always thought that was like a really interesting, like simple way to explain like how minority groups become persecuted. Let's get a little too deep. How about Minecraft chat? Uh, Legos. You guys like Legos? I like Legos. <laughs> Matthew Santoro should have more debates. Who is Matthew Santoro? I gotta say, I don't know that one. Somebody keeps flipping their like to a dislike. Bro, just stick the landing, dude. Like it or dislike it, I don't care. Two dislikes, bruh. Somebody's salty in the chat. A little sub for sub kids are getting real salty. Actually, that one kid, Kane Band, probably did leave a dislike or two. What, uh, what was it? What was the name? It's curious. The name Matthew Santoro. That name sounds super familiar. Maybe if I pull it up, I'll recognize him. Matthew Santiago. Calling out Matthew Santoro. Matthew Santoro is a Canadian YouTuber. He produces top 10 lists and 50 amazing 50 uh, ugh, on his main channel. I can't read. I can't read. He's a 34 year old YouTuber. What does he do? Was he like a? Is he like a debater? It seems like he mostly just takes makes top list. Ten ways climate change will affect the world. Fifty amazing facts to blow your mind. Oh, he's the amazing facts to blow your mind guy. Oh, I know this guy. I don't think I've ever watched one of his videos though. Is his stuff good? I mean, he's got six million subscribers. It's got to be pretty good. Ugh. He's a nice looking charming psychopath that everyone loves. Aw. You allow chats about politics and religion? Not really. Not really. To a minor degree, we can like have brief discussions, but if it starts to feel like, if I feel like it's starting to head in a wrong direction, I'll just generally say no, not really. I thought you were too busy to Google stuff. I Google what I want to Google, all right? I don't Google stuff you guys tell me to Google. <laughs> Hey bro, I can put together a nice short signature intro for your videos for $10. I can send a few samples. I would need your email. No, thank you. I already have one and it's probably better than what you can make. No offense. I have like three different intros I use on my channel based on what my videos are and no offense, but you can go peep one. I think they're pretty good myself. All right, what to do? What to do? I could keep streaming. I guess I could start cooking dinner. I was going to probably cook wings tonight, which really just means I need to turn on the oven. Chat, I'm gonna go turn on the oven. I'll be right back. I'm gonna keep streaming for a little bit, at least longer. Appreciate the offer though, dude, but uh, no thank you. If anybody leaves, um, you're a poopy pants. That's right, Chad. If you leave while I'm gone, you're a poopy pants. So, you know, I'm not saying you can't leave, but I know I wouldn't. Wait, I am leaving to go make food. Well, I'm coming back, so it doesn't count.
<gasps> Somebody left. Somebody's a poopy pants. Hey, what up, Mac? I used to watch Matthew Santoro all the time when I was younger. Nice. Doesn't have any debates at all, but I'd love to hear him debate something. <laughs> Never know, he might be good at it. It's is. I don't know, it's is what? It's is good, it's is whatever. I appreciate the offer, man, but like I said, I'm, I actually know some animation myself, so I'm pretty good. Make sure you lick all the wings first before baking them. They're raw wings. No, it's raw chicken, man. Love to chat about politics. It's the most thought-provoking subject there is. Yeah, I, yeah, but it also causes people to get mad and upsetty in their spaghetti, and uh, I'm not trying to have debates and arguments uh, with people in chat, so I typically don't do it. I have 12 hours before I have to wake up tomorrow. Eat, I can watch this movie. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, I need to set a timer for like an hour and five minutes for the wings. Timer's good, all right. I don't know if we're gonna stream all the way to the end of that time, but uh, I've got an hour at most. Chip in for some wing delivery. Yeah, for me, not for you, chat. You don't get to pull together for yourselves. You gotta pull together for me. Subscribe to Minecraft mods. No, get banned, dog. Kane, ban that account. Yeah, but it's exactly a, a calm one. Not much to talk about. I don't... I try not to discuss politics too much either, because... I'm only so well educated on the different matters, you know? And I don't think if you're educated on politics that you should be doing it. Kane or Mac, please ban that spam account that just came in here and asked for sub. Eat that stuff so much, dude. Get your own channels. Grow your own brand. Don't be nerds. What my channel must be getting recommended to people or something right now. It's hitting those. Uh, it's hitting those recommendation boxes, and that is always kind of a rough time. All right. We got. This is probably enough glass to go finish our project real quick. Yeah, let's go do that. Let's go finish that build we were working on. Wait, we need uh, magma brick too. Someone get offended? Good, they've been given something to think about. Mm. See, my issue with that thought process is... I don't... I think... That the only way to truly change someone's mind... And there have been psychological studies backing up this mentality. Where did this bow come from? I don't want this. Rips. <laughs> Is uh, that the only way to truly change someone's mind is through a positive workspace? All dislikers will have their spleen privileges taken. Yeah, dude, we're apparently getting recommended tonight because you guys have been liking and watching the stream so much recently. It's starting to get recommended to people again. Uh, but that also is going to just come with annoying dislikes and stuff of that nature. Actually, I don't know if this is enough glass. Oh, whatever. Let's start with this and go on from there. Actually, I'm almost certain this is not going to be enough glass, but by the time we do this, the rest of it will be done. Uh, but so, like, if you're offending people or people are getting offended, really, it just uh, reinforces their beliefs. When people get angry, it reinforces their beliefs because then it feels like an argument over, like, personal beliefs. And personal beliefs can only be changed through, like, uh, through good faith and mutual understanding. If someone's getting offended, really, it maybe they're wrong, but it's just reinforcing their ideas even stronger from a psychological standpoint like i actually don't agree with that that's why i actually don't think debating is that uh, is a good way to change anybody's mind it really just reinforces everybody's opinion plus like um uh, uh whatever i totally slipped on what i was gonna say name one psychological study that proved that i don't know google it dog what am i supposed to know the names of the psychological studies It's like today, like everything's become so like my team versus your team. It's hard to get anybody to change their mind because it feels like they're like changing like their team, you know? It's all like politics has become like a basketball game. Which I know is like the cliche that everybody sounds like, but I mean, it, it does feel pretty true. Wow, I had nowhere near enough glass in my inventory. Oh, this glass will be enough, idiot. That's what I sounded like just now. Redeem kidneys, no. Redeem spleens, no. Alright, well there should be enough glass cooking right now to finish. This for real. 
You still live. You're still live. Yes. <laughs> I am also still alive. I'm still live and live. I, uh, I don't know. I'm having a good stream. Figured might as well just kind of keep it going. I'm cooking dinner right now, though. I just put it in the oven, so at most I will be on for another hour. At most. At most in Dolby Surround Sound? Isn't there another set of netherrack? Nope, I'm insane! Cool. Well, I already kind of knew that, so that's not really a big bummer or anything. Pretty much just information I already had. Anti-vaxxers piss me off quite a bit. That doesn't really make me think about it. Yeah, well, the anti-vaxxers are idiots. I feel like that's not political to say. We believe in science on this channel, so saying things like the Earth is definitely not flat and the uh, vaccines work, you know, it's not a debate because that's just scientific fact. Science deniers can go to hell, man. That's the one thing I do not, I cannot stand. It's fucking science deniers, man. Can't deny science. Which I know sounds dangerously close to the facts don't care about your feelings, but usually those arguments are perpetuated by these. Oh, I remember what I was going to say about debating a second ago. Oh, yeah. Um, debating is a skill in and of itself, so like I always just feel like, you know, it's like the way that uh, Jordan Peterson goes to these schools, right? And then he like goes to these schools and debates these kids to own the liberals but like really you just have a guy who is an incredibly wealthy and because he's wealthy well educated uh debater who could be literally a professional level debater uh going and preying on young idealistic children basically who just got out of high school you know who were literally considered kids three months ago through most of society's metrics for judging whether or not someone is an adult, and uh, he picks on them by debating them and making himself seem smart. He's an Ivy League school graduate who goes to colleges and debates 18-year-olds on the spot with well-prepared facts and information to quote-unquote own the libs. That's why the gun girl keeps trying to do that, and it doesn't work for her because she's not an Ivy School League graduate with tons of information and a supporting team behind her. And she keeps getting like, she keeps walking away looking like an idiot because she is an idiot. So I always say it's a disservice to say people like Jordan Peterson aren't smart. Jordan Peterson is incredibly smart. You can disagree with his policies, but... Trying to say he's not smart just gives more weight to his argument and makes your side look worse. To recognize that smart people will be on the opposite side from you. Oh man. You'll never take my livers. Oh, we'll get that liver. Didn't become a basketball game, it's always was you just don't noticing more because of Twitter. No, that's not true. I'm talking like prior to that. Look at the way that the Senate used to vote across party line issues. You can find all sorts of political maps that show that most, um, most of these, you see, look at, this is why I don't talk politics. Look how the view counts gone down since we started talking politics. Ben Shapiro or George, or Ben Shapiro, I meant. Ben Shapiro. Well, I'm going to get off of this subject because it's bad for viewership and I don't want to talk about it, dude. The world isn't a sphere though. No, I mean, it's a little more oblong, I guess. He very much believes in it. My mom's an anti-vaxxer, and I don't know how to have a, that conversation with her. I just avoid talking to her about it. I'm a writer IRL. I write mostly horror and thriller stuff. My only two goals with my stories is something to think about and at the same time be entertaining. I do get it. I write and direct and work in movie production. I understand. But the stream is not the place for that, you know? Stream is a different form of media, and the goal of the stream is not that. Am I banned or something? Also, read my last statement. You're not banned. You're here. I'm just scrolling backwards through chat. Dueling, dueling, dueling. Anti-vaxxer equals poop. Wavy dash. Nose. Mask. I don't know what that means. Never mind. You're good, man. Uh, da -da -da -da. Yeah, dude. I don't know. The science deniers are what give me. What do you want, Kane? What do you want? Oh, I don't know that. Whatever. 
Uh, fine. I'll pull this up for later. I'm not gonna play this right now. I'll watch that after the stream. Whatever, whatever weirdo ness that is, Kane. I will watch it after the stream is over. Just like I'm gonna watch that wrestling video. Lol. Slob on my knob is like corn on the cob. Jordan Peterson. Slob on my knob. Is that like a terrible lyric from some song? Like, what is that song? I remember it being like an otherwise good song and it just has like that horrible, horrible verse in it. It's like, slob on my knob and it's like all like off key and stuff. Like, ugh, that's terrible. All right, we've almost built our glass under enchantment table thingy all the way down. Go down another like two layers, right? Good news is, I think it looks pretty good. It's the most important thing, chat. I mean, really, genuinely, in Minecraft. I mean, this is all for looks. All the about the aesthetics, chat. Deny. Sorry, I'm an attention whore. I felt ignored, so I thought I might be banned. No, you're good. You're good. You're not banned. No, I don't ban people without warning unless they just... Like, that one guy that got banned without warning is because he came in here and... Uh, spammed. Actually, did somebody ban him? Or did I? I didn't look. Did somebody ban him? Can you guys confirm that he got banned? If you just straight in drop in my channel and just go sub for sub or like sub to my channel or like whatever self promotion, then yeah, I'm just gonna ban you without warning because obviously you don't care about the channel anyways. But someone who's talking and engaging, I give warnings before I get to bans. And usually you'll be timed out before you're banned. Yeah, I don't. I try not to go too ban happy. King of Terrible Off Key Lyrics is, of course, Blurface. Blurface. I don't know. Is that his name? Is that the guy? I'm playing Sea of Thieves. Nice. Looks fun, man. Are you like the only person still playing that game? <laughs> you gotta be in the minority at this point, dude. I gotta watch my pickaxe too. Can't risk losing a good pickaxe here. This is actually like the perfect pickaxe. I guess we need one more pickaxe with silk touch. That'll be our next enchantment we actually need to go for. So maybe we'll have to hold off on that enchanted diamond shovel for just now. Sub for sub, Kane of Christmas. Kane, we already are sub to each other. We can't sub for sub. We already did. <laughs> Technically, our, I mean, we didn't sub for sub, but we are sub to each other. Guys, if you like, um, you know, if you like Binding of Isaac streams, Kane is a Binding of Isaac streamer. I gotta start paying attention to all the blocks before I dig down like this. Whatever. Silly me. Happens to the best of us. Dang it. <laughs> no! Fell down. Fell down the hole. Chat, should I use my old pineapple habanero wing sauce tonight for my wings when I make them? Or should I use the new spicy pineapple... No, wait, was it? Is it pineapple or mango? I think it's mango honey mustard or something like that. I forget exactly what it is, but it's like a spicy tropical honey mustard. I got it the last time I was up in Cincinnati. I went to Jungle Gyms, which is like the greatest grocery store ever. Chat, you know how you're getting old? Is you get really excited about a good grocery store. <laughs> Chat, I get pumped for a good grocery store. I'll be honest. I go to Cincinnati to visit my friend Cassie. They've got like two really sick grocery stores that are huge and have crazy selections on like hot sauces and like alcohols and like all sorts of cheeses and whatever other like, like all sorts of international foods. Chat, I get pumped. All right, I get real pumped about this. I am about a good grocery store, dude. There's nothing more exciting to an adult than like a really good grocery store. That is the saddest thing I think I've ever said. Use the fruity sauce? I think I will. The other sauce is like pretty much done anyways. I like I've used it most of it up at this point. Last time I used it, I like had to water it down a little bit to like, there was like some of it that kind of was dried into the bottle. So I took what was left and I, um, put a little water in it and shook it up so that I could get like the last little bit of flavor but I'll probably just use that for like some basic stuff now normally I save the fancy hot sauces for like 
you know, like wings or something like we'll really taste them and then i like if i'm gonna do like i use mac and cheese and put hot sauce in that or whatever that kind of stuff i'll like i'll put like a cholula or whatever in i love my hot sauces chat hot sauce is so good hot sauce is the best chat i don't know i'm like really obsessed with hot sauces now i i, I used to be terrified of hot sauces. I used to never eat any hot sauces ever. And then I started watching hot ones. And then I was like, all right, I could get into this. I could, I could try some of these out, get out of my comfort zone. Also Indian food was the other thing. I used to like really avoid hot food. I just never had a lot of it growing up. So like, I guess I had like this stigma about it. I was like, oh, it's too hot. You know, I, you know, I don't like jalapenos. I don't like hot foods. I'm, I was really just scared of them, honestly. And then, uh, then that all changed when the Fire Nation attacked. Nah, but honestly, that did change. Like, I started to eat more, like, Indian food and other culture of cuisines with some spice in it. Um, and, uh, just started pushing myself to try more hot foods. I'm pretty open to new foods in general, though. I'm like, I love to try new things. I mean, these days, I'm, like, all about trying new things. I rarely get the same thing from the same restaurant twice. There's only like a few restaurants that I go to where I'll get the same thing that I've gotten before and most of those are just because I've been there so many times I've tried everything I want to try on the menu and now I know what's are my favorite things Like I'm huge into like trying new foods I don't get these people who like don't try new foods ever I know that I work with this guy who literally he only eats chicken nuggets and pizza And I'm actually not even joking to you Every day we have like catered food. Most days he just doesn't eat, which also I don't know how he does because we work 12 hour days. Oh my God, Diamond. Thanks for stopping by, blah, blah, blah. If you know when the worst thing is saving a sauce for a special occasion that you never use it and it goes bad, oof. That is bad, man. Hell yeah, free diamonds. Where is something I can fill these holes with? That's what she said. Hey, oh. Um, what were we talking about before the hayo? Oh, yeah. Yeah, so, like, I don't know how he does it. We work 12-hour days. Some, most days he just doesn't eat unless there's, like, pizza or something. I thought my pickaxe just broke there for a second, and I was about to panic. Straight up about to panic at the disco. Fixing this is gonna be a pain. All this stuff that was by the water is gonna be a pain in the butt to fix. Yeah, whatever, one step at a time. Collins do great interviews, just not for a few months. Wait, you don't like the recent episodes? I like the recent episodes, I thought they've had some good ones. Maybe some of us are poor, Aaron, you ever think about that? I'm poor. All just about you know how you prioritize your money i don't know kane get a job dog i'm broke but at least i'm out there working <laughs> you know i'm on task rabbit i'm filling in the gaps in between production work i'm doing my part look man i'm broke look dude my friends probably all think i hate them dude i was just starting to hang out with some new people from like my film world too, you know, establishing new friendships. And uh now probably all like, well, I guess Aaron didn't like me very much because uh he has not talked to me in a very long time. And actually, it's just that I've been afraid to leave the house and spend money. Man, I still don't have enough glass. How was this last like 10% of the project taking like 90% more glass? Oh god, help, I'm stuck. Only chicken nuggets and pizza, was he seven? He eats like a seven-year-old is the best way to describe it. Super nice guy, I love that guy. Such a good guy, dude. Super fun guy to work with, super nice guy, always pleasant. Literally like one of those people that's just always nice. Love working with him, dude. I love walking on the set and seeing him be there. Uh, but he eats like a seven-year-old and he knows it. I have asked him straight up. I just asked him one day, I was like, why do you eat like a seven-year-old? And he's just, he told me he's like food phobic. He's afraid to try new things. Like he's like legit has like a phobia of eating like different foods is what he says. I don't know. 
to the legitimacy of that or not but i mean i i mean i do believe them i've never heard of it before but i mean you guess you could technically be a, like have a phobia of anything right i'm with you i'm about to eat one of my shoes dude i'm so hungry why don't homeless people just buy a home? Wait, well, do not put the words in my mouth, Kane. You're not homeless. Kane, you're an able-bodied 20-year-old who can totally go get a job. <laughs> get a job, you bum. Get a job, you bums. You're doing deep cleaning for old women, yeah. I made all you 100 bucks for five hours of work, dog. I made 18 bucks an hour. Tomorrow I'm making $27 an hour and I signed up for TaskRabbit with no money at home and it's easy as hell. Expensive China. Why would you ever buy expensive plates you'll never use to basically flex? I mean, it's all about flexing. Most of the being rich is just flexing your money on other people. Must be from the deep south. Who's from the deep south? I have a phobia of cats. See? Carter's got a phobia of cats. Feline phobia definitely has got to be a thing. I wonder what the name for it is. Chat, what's the name for feline phobia? Because it's a nice accent piece and could rise in value and not maintain the original value be momentous through generations. Rich people get to invest their money. I'm just like, I like good grocery stores because I can buy fancy hot sauces for $10 a bottle and then try and make them last for a year at a time. <laughs> My last bottle of hot sauce did last me not a year, but a long time. But I only use it for special like that's what I'm talking about like I only use these hot sauces for special foods and things like I don't even put them in normal stuff which I would love to certainly foods and things I would put in them these skeletons walking around I should like open this up more you know What's my pickaxe doing? I gotta keep an eye on it. I gotta repair it before we do any other projects. Alright, we're starting to get to bedrock. Got to bedrock. The actor that is food phobic must be from a deep south. Oh no, he's not a well, he's not an actor. He's a cameraman. Uh why would why would he be from the big uh deep south? The big south! Hey -o! Probably philophobia for cats or something like that. Yeah. No, I should have meant. Yeah, that guy's not an actor. Oh, yeah. Give me that sweet, sweet bedrock, baby. I feel like I should do something else down here, but I can always come down here and do it later, I guess. It's not like I can't come back. I'm wondering like if I could come down here and like, I want to put something down here. Maybe like all magma stone on the bottom. Like, at, like I know we dug all the way down to bedrock, but maybe instead of like leaving it as bedrock, we uh we just put like a nice layer of um. Uh, that'll look fine. Put a nice layer of uh, magma block all the way on the bottom. That could look good. I think that would look pretty sick. And green eggs and ham and bacon. I feel like you have a very false perception of the Deep South. Look, the Deep South, the Deep South does like, you know, exclusively like to eat food that could kill you in possibly one sitting. <laughs> Duh. You know, times are a changing. I think people become more and more open to things. Including even the deep south, baby. Does it even hurt me? Does that do anything negative to me at all? Or does it just make that noise? Redeem pizza. Bro, you ain't getting no pizza from me, dog. That's a no from me, dog. I guess I should have been mining more inward because that whole part's got to be empty too. Is 
definitely want to do something with the magma. Whether it's the whole bottom floor or maybe like just like the outer edge of like the bottom glass layer could be magma block. And then uh, like a little like cross pattern in towards the center. Give it like a little pattern, you know? Got pretty lucky on this. No big magma spills, nothing crazy to deal with, nothing terribly awful. Aaron, you should try Jamaican food. You know, actually, I don't think I've had a lot of Jamaican food. Have I really had any Jamaican food? But you Jamaican me want to. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba. Sorry, Chad, I had to do it. <laughs> I could not do it, Chad. I'm sorry. Thought it was pretty good honestly i think two people left over that joke stuff like deep fried buttermilk steak man if that's how i go i'm gonna die happy honestly yeah i mean southern food is delicious love to take on a caribbean food try your take on caribbean food oh i grew up in the deep south all right all right he knows what he's talking about then i did not grow up in the deep south the shallow south at best if there is a deep south then kentucky is the shallow south Like Indiana, which is further north, but ironically far more southern than we are. So that's what I always tell myself. At least I, more than Louisville, you know. That's always the trade-off. Is like, it may not be true in general for the entirety of the state, but for Louisville, where I live, versus the parts of Indiana that I go to, it is 100% true. It, is, it gets real southern the further north you go. That's, that's a local saying because we don't like being associated with the South. People in Louisville do not like being called Southern. Case in point, me. I hate being called Southern. I live in Kentucky, I get it. But I live in Louisville, it's not the South, it doesn't count, how dare you? You've offended me, get out of my front lawn. Hey, why is Jelly? I know, trust me, we all know. <laughs> it has been pointed out to us. You know what, we're kind of okay with it. I'm okay with it at least. I think of worse things than being known for like uh, sex jelly, you know? Yeah, that's kind of what I'm thinking, chat. Just do this whole bottom layer here. And uh, magma block. It'll give it a nice cool little look. That is wrong. Fortunately, I did not bring enough magma block to do this, because that was not the plan. But, uh, you know, it'll look good still. Just have to go get some more. I've got a billion blocks of magma, so no harm, no foul. I'm just far enough away from Florida so that Florida man cannot easily reach me. That's good. That's you got to for safety, dude. Florida scares me, man. Florida is a scary state, dude. I don't know how anybody stays alive in that state, quite frankly. It seems like I don't know, like I do you guys watch the good place ever? Cause like Jason from the Good Place is always, I think, like a great example of that. <laughs> It's mostly just like a, a vessel for Florida jokes, and they're always great. Hello, welcome back, b -son. How's it going, man? How's your night been? Yoink. I have enough glass? Well, I might need more glass, too, so this works out in two folds. I love their curry shrimp. Ooh, curry shrimp sounds so good. Make a family start a small restaurant is so good. Dude, curry shrimp sounds so good. I've heard people describe Indian Indiana described as the equivalent of a weeb trying to be a part of the culture they have nothing to do with and embarrassing themselves. Yeah, actually, yeah, that's pretty great. It's like that, but you know, southern. Let's go ahead and repair this pickaxe. I don't I don't wanna risk this pickaxe like dying. Ah, seven enchantment. Oof. 
That costs seven diamond too? Holy crap. Does it count cost equal enchantment and diamond? I'm gonna have to make a new pickaxe then too. That sucks. I'm gonna have to make two new pickaxes then, really. Because I need a silk touch one and this one. Whatever. I gotta get all those ender pearls while I've got this um looting sword. Florida is just open GTA online lobby, changed my mind. I mean, I don't think I can change your mind when you're so factually correct. <laughs> When you write, you write. I think that's one of the dumbest sayings ever. When you write, you're right. Yeah, no duh. When you're standing in your home, you're standing in your home. Yeah, thanks, dude. Thanks, Captain Obvious. Thanks, Captain Smarty Pants. It's all homemade curry too, so I love it. God, you're making me so hungry, chat. I shouldn't have made wings. I just ended the stream and like gone to Zaxby's and gotten some chicken. Uh, there's a sm yeah. Dude, I want some Jamaican food now. Jamaican jerk chicken. We have a Cuban restaurant by my house. It is so good, dude. They have the best Cuban sandwiches ever. Oh my god, they're so delicious. And regular Cuban food. Do they make this half chicken fried with like beans and rice? Ooh, it is so good, dude. I like just devour the entire plate. Oh my god, and the empanadas this place makes are. <laughs> That noise is the only accurate description of the food that I could properly give you. Alright, this should hopefully be enough glass and magma to finish this. Once and for all. Once and for all. You versus me enchantment table hole. Oh, that looks real good. I'm glad we did this. Not bomb. Chat, we should listen to Poyo sometime. Probably not now, because the stream... Yeah, it's not over though. York is an ashtray, at least in my town. Okay, we gotta be careful here. Don't want to fall to our death. Uh, there is an artist who does music very much in the style that you're hearing right now called Pogo. And uh, he's very, very talented. Very, very good. It's like this lo fi, but it's specifically like this kind of lo fi with this like mix of. Um, uh, like lots of like voices like like tiny little like one syllable voice clips that's kind of like his shtick it always makes me wonder if this song is made by him when it comes up on our, our playlist here I don't think it is I think I, I've looked it up a couple times and it's not him but it sounds just like him but he's got some really good ones and he rakes all sorts of stuff like Winnie the Pooh uh... oh, he's done a bunch of stuff all really really good Spots. Here. Bum, bum, bum. Why not just play one song? Wait, how many wings are you cooking? Nine. I just cook them in the oven, though. I'd kill for a barbecue right now, dude. I would kill for barbecue. Ash, not ah. Um, New York is an ashtray, at least in my town. That sucks. Mercury shrimp that gave me really bad food poisoning now can't touch stuff. Oh, that's terrible. You agreed with me on something? Yes. I agree with you on some stuff, just not a lot of stuff. Look, man, I have a, a really, really close friend. One of my closest friends these days, really. Um, him and I disagree on almost every movie that we see. Like, we can almost guarantee that if one of us likes or hates a movie, the other one will do the opposite. Like, or at least, like... If one of us likes it, the other one will be like, one of us will like love the movie, the other one might be like, it's okay. Alright. We we'll, we agree on like three movies total, and we watch movies together all the time. He's one of my friends who helped get me started in movies. Like, we both watch a lot of movies, man. It's just always funny, man. But uh, we, so we don't, see, we hardly agree on anything, but we're still good friends. You don't have to agree to be friends all the time, you know? Sometimes strong friendships are forged despite not agreeing on a lot of stuff. Sometimes those are the best friendships, you know? Remember kiddos, if you the stream isn't liked, your spleen will be extracted on a pike? Jesus.
This water is not making things easier. There we go. Right. I am not gonna have enough glass to finish this, honestly, I don't think, because I have to do like... I have this like... T this is like the bottom part, that's fine. But this part like behind the water still needs to be finished too. Uh, does he like cats? Because if he does, he might need help. My friend? I think he likes... I don't know if he likes cats or not. Chicken pot pie would be amazing. Dude, there's a place by me that makes a chicken pot pie from scratch and... Oh man, I can never have another regular chicken pot pie. Can I just play one song? Alright, let's play one pogo song real quick. Pogo... I think it's pogo. I hope I'm remembering it right. Can't type right now, hold on. Pogo, music, yeah. This is, uh, Alice. Put in here for you guys too. It is if you have the stream, yeah, yeah. Uh, like Mac and I, yep, you can crouch on Megwin and not take damage, but I'm not taking damage though. It's just making the noise, but I'm not taking any damage. But half the time we hang out arguing about trivial. I've had friends like that. I try not to argue with my friends as much anymore, or like do that, oh, if I'm insulting you, it's because I like you, BS, but, you know. Definitely, I like arguing with some of my friends. Well, the cats taste like chicken? Okay, no, 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 no. Don't support that. <laughs> I do not do that to you. Okay, so I'm thinking that. But I'm thinking the other thing we do here. This is going to be difficult now that I've already gotten rid of all the bedrock. So we make like a cross here, maybe? This should all be odd numbered, which means this should work perfectly. I don't feel like it should be able to do that underwater, but whatever, that's an argument for a different time. Yeah, I think that will look super good. All right, and now we gotta come up here. This is gonna be tough. I just gotta get, stop. There's one, come on, give me a two. Just need the second one, and there we go. Woo, just gotta fill in all this little brick with uh, glass, basically, now going up. Maybe I should start at the top and let it like go, like dig my way. I could do this too. This will work. I've got an idea. I'm not gonna have enough glass again. Jesus. I don't have to go too fast here. I don't want to like lose it. That glass, perfect. Boop. All right, one step at a time, chat, slowly going down. Trying not to fall to my death because that would be embarrassing. Ow. <laughs> okay. Not what I was expecting. Also, the water is so clear, it is making me a little nervous. I think this is probably just playing now. I think his pogo is really good though. Dogs also apparently taste like chicken. Stop! <laughs> My dad makes chicken pot pie from scratch. It's super good. My mom's boss told us that instead of making it with normal potatoes, make it with mashed potatoes. And oh my god. Oh my god, that sounds so good! That should be illegal, dude. Seems like I've heard of mashed pot pies, but I don't think I've ever tried one. Sounds delicious. Dude, I need to make that. Maybe that'll be my next recipe. Videos with Asian people trying eating dogs and reading the triggered Western comments freaking out. Jesus Christ. No, how did I not have enough glass? And also I left this floating block down here. Alright, that sucks. Not enough glass. 
pretty lame. Also, in order for this to work, gotta put a little cobblestone right here, probably, for now. I can get back up and out. Alright, I need like a handful more glass. I cannot believe that was not enough glass. Music suggestions, search YouTube for Mega Man 3 guitar cover, Snake Man, Tar Bros. Alright. Yeah, might as well. Alright, let's see what he got here. Mega Man 3, Guitar Cover, Snake Man, Super Guitar Bros. I do love good guitar covers of stuff too. As you could probably imagine, for obvious reasons. Ooh, that's a classical guitar. I recognize that sound. Classical guitars are so underrated, chat. Classical guitar is like my favorite version of acoustic guitar. It has such a good sound. That like... It's so like smooth. It's so it's so beautiful, really. Chat, I will finish the stupid project before I end the stream and go eat dinner. We're also we're on a timer for when the stream ends, because the wings once they're cooked, you gotta be quick, man. You let them cool for like two minutes, you sauce them, and then you eat them before they get cold. And that means you gotta start like right away. Like you don't want them to get cold. They're not very good once they get cold. I hear a witch. I have to go kill this witch with my looting sword. I mean, you're not really my prime directive right now, witch, but I will come kill you if that's what you really want. Where are you? Where is she? Don't be all sinister laughy and then hide from me, there you are. Don't do it, don't do it. Don't do it, you punk. You punk ass bitch. Did you just give me a stick? What a loser. She didn't even give me anything good, chat. you believe that? I mean, I can't, but like, are you not disappointed in that? Because I also am. I could be not surprised and disappointed. Or can I? Are those things mutually exclusive? Oh, God! <laughs> oh, thank you. For your help. Oh god, oh god, eat, eat, eat. Eat, you're too skinny. Can I not be poisoned anymore? Poisoned is done now. No more poison. <coughs> That's a lot of poison. That's a lot of poison. How many wings do you have in the oven? Nine? I have nine wings in the oven. Ready to be tossed in some honey mustard sauce. Actually, maybe I'll toss them in two sauces. I could toss them in two sauces. Chad, it's so good. So what I do is I'll take a, a tablespoon of butter, like three tablespoons of hot sauce. I'll melt the butter in the microwave, mix it with the hot sauce, pour that over the wings, and then I eat them like that. Sometimes I use blue cheese, but usually if I'm making my own wings at home, I don't use blue cheese. I just don't sauce them too much. That's kind of the goal, right? Like if you just, if you're making them at home, you just don't put too much sauce on. They won't be too, too hot. It seems silly to buy fancy nice hot sauces and then like, you know, uh, cover them in blue cheese. Kind of feels like defeating the purpose of like making your own wings. I wonder if these guys write tabs for their music. It's not dinner, that's a snack. I was probably gonna make something with it. Actually, nine wings will fill me up. How many wings would you make? Killing people and or looting their bodies is very illegal. What? Why not person meat? Oh god. That's not good. Why do you have an uneven number of wings? I don't know. It's, Jesus Christ, Chad. Stop with the third degree. Chat, you're so judgmental. Do you know that? Are you aware of that, Chat? Very judgy. Big Wom, you are so evil with your delicious food taunting. Hey man, I'm putting in the work, alright? I can cook. I don't cook a lot of anything like too fancy, but... I think I have a good head for food. Good tal- uh, good palate. Some guy told me I should start vaping because it's fun, and I'm like, I know it's fun because Mr. Wigwam does it. I don't do it, I haven't vaped in months, thank you. 
check out to my Patreon. All right, everybody, go check out that guy's channel. It's really cool. That sick Guitar Hero, or not Guitar Hero, Mega Man 3 cover. No, I said Guitar Hero 3 cover. Yeah, and we're owning it. <laughs> Stop. Oh, da, da, da. Isn't it also illegal to kill dogs in the US? Yes, it is. You guys are owning it. You guys are definitely owning it. You guys definitely own being a bully. Do, 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 do. Take this garbage out of my hand. Jaded Misfits. So my friend linked your stream via SC. Good stuff. Thanks, man. What is SC? I don't know what SC is. So I'm glad you liked it. And thank you to whoever your friend was who linked it as well. Love the support, man. Chat, remember, if, either, if you ever want to support the stream and you don't have the money for Patreon or whatever, that's cool, that's fine. You know, financial support is a lot to ask of people, I get that. I don't really financially support any streams right now myself, so like I wouldn't, I can't ask people to do too much of the same, but the thing you can always do is just share it to people you think might dig it, because the more people out there, you know, the, the you've seen tonight, right? Like, so we were doing good numbers tonight, and then YouTube started to promote the stream and new people started to come in. That's what it is, man. That's what it is, dude. Just sharing the stream, watching the stream, chatting in the stream, and uh, sharing the stream, you know? Just helping it grow. It's like the best thing you could do. Okay. Didn't die. Been having a really good time streaming recently, too, chat. I'm, like, enjoying streaming more and more. I mean, I always enjoy it, but, like, we just feel like we've been on a... I had some really good streams recently. It was really cool. It's all thanks to you guys, you know? It's easy to stream when people are here and hanging out. It's hard to stream when nobody's here and nobody's hanging out. It's done, chat! It is done! With two random torches that I don't really... Alright, we gotta do something about the torches. God dang it. I have dirt. Alright. Shovel's about to break, though. I gotta take care of those torches or it's gonna bother me for all eternity. Alright, so let's do this and hopefully not die. Right, put a block down, please. Alright, there's one. The other one. Oh, I need to go up more, not down. That's it. Okay, good. No more torches! No more torches, good. Be very careful here, chat. Not gonna die. Oh god. I was like, what am I standing on? And then realized I was like on a dirt block and almost just died. Let's break this break this block. I'm not B Sun. God damn it. Snapchat. Snapchat? Who is promoting my stream on Snapchat? Major kudos, man. Get the word out. Alright, chat. That's it. We did it. Alright, crafting table. Finally, we can say is complete. Kind of felt like digging down to bedrock was going to be a bigger deal. It really wasn't. People throw the word beast on on your channel? I'm about to, dude. Beast on is a person that always has different fake accounts. Good, you're not like Bad Bunny. Is there other occasion? Is there some occasions? Is it okay to be rude? Yeah, I don't know. If somebody's a real dick, then be a dick back to them. Kind of about that. I'm not really a turn the other cheek guy. I'm more like a, if a person sucks, then fuck them. <laughs> like if they really truly suck in their soul, then yeah, fuck them. <laughs> we debating morality or laws? No. <laughs> You're enjoying us, not the stream. Ah, uh, yeah. We are the lords. No. Yes to the first part. No to the second part. We deserve fish. No, you don't. Can tell your mom if you want fish. That's not my job. Kane owns the libs with facts and knowledge. Is that a religion? <laughs> Could be. Jaded B Sun has like a thousand accounts and job jobs the stream? What do you mean jobs the stream? I'm fucking youth you is running joke going on here that B Sun always comes into chat with fake accounts. Yep. I promoted you on my story. Nice! Thank you so much. That's so sweet. My girl is awesome. Nice. You can kind of tell the texture too. I didn't think it would show up, but you can kind of tell the different depths around the edge of the blocks. 
which I think I like. I think it gives it kind of a rougher look. Although I wish that like the one corner down on the bottom right there wasn't so bad. He only made one account today. Good. He's getting better. So something I am thinking about doing though is like, I think I think I actually need to do. Gotta be careful here with this. I'm pretty. I hope I still have some purple dye, or at least just pur maybe pre-dyed blocks. Yes, that's better. All right, one last people purple glass, and we got it. Happy to be a part of it. We're glad to have you here. Ask your wife if you want fish. Yeah. Ask whoever in your life is in charge of your food situation for some fish. Because it's not me, chat. It's not me. I do have some purple glass left. Thank God. I figured I did. I always try to make extra. So, like, when you come back later and do adjustments and stuff. It's like you always want to have extra, right? You never want to just have the exact perfect amount for a build. Alright, chat. It's done. It is done. The quartz room still needs lots and lots of work, but this is done. Our magical enchantment table fueled by magma all the way down to the earth center. I think it turned out pretty well. It's not right. It's missing a magma block. Son of a bitch. It's missing one magma block in this corner right here. Ah, no. <laughs> Alright, hold on, chat. I'm not leaving until this is fixed. How much time do we have before my food's done? We got 15 minutes. Okay, that's plenty of time. No, a fish tank. Oh. I will build a fish tank. Fine, I don't know. Next time, I guess? I could be beast on. I don't know. Am I even real? Alright, you're getting way too existential, alright? Ow, don't care. Okay, and I, while I'm down here... Oh, I don't control it though. Well, actually, so what I could do, I think that would make this more even is that. Make it look better. And honestly, if I kind of heighten this up a little bit, I think it would be... I think if I textured it a little more, it would look better. Alright, I think that's good. Alright. I cannot believe I somehow totally missed that. I mean, I can and do, and obviously it seems like something, seems like exactly something I would do, but in a, in a less true sense, it feels great to me if I can say I don't, I can't believe that. Okay, yep, that looks a lot better. Look at that, dude. It's like a Pokeball of Destiny shooting its, shooting its shot up into the heavens. All right, that is good stuff. All right, chat, I think that's time to uh, wind down the stream and get ready to go eat, man. Uh, it's been a really, really fun stream, a great stream. Really awesome to have everybody hanging out. Great numbers, super fun, super accomplished. Four and a half hours stream. Don't say I don't love you, chat. I just streamed for four and a half hours. That's uh, that's the longest stream I've done in a really long time. Longest stream, I think, ever that wasn't like a, one of those streams where I was like, I'm going to sit down and beat this game in one sitting. Those are like the only other streams that have been longer than this. This is like the longest just like, just stream stream, you know? So if you haven't yet, drop it a like, please, if you did like. If you're not subbed and you're new here today, uh, you know, consider subbing for more if you liked what you saw. If you didn't like the stream today and you're still watching, lick my taint. I don't care. Why didn't you just click away if you didn't like it? It seems pretty obvious to me. But for the rest of you, uh, I love you guys. You always make streaming fun. I look forward to seeing you guys. My plan is to stream tomorrow. Like I said, I have a job in the morning that's going to be pretty physically exhausting. So if I'm too tired, I may skip the stream. I'll post it on the uh, Discord whether or not I stream. I'm not really a B-son. Thank God. Honestly, thank God. Thanks for the stream, B-son. Stop. 15 minutes before chicken fallout. Press 1 to accept. Press 2 to cancel. Uh, why not just speed eat the wings and then continue streaming? Nah, dude. I Because I can't stream that much later. I have to go to bed early tonight. Because I have to be up early tomorrow to work this job. So I only have a couple hours before bed and I want to unwind before bed. If I didn't have to work tomorrow, I would actually consider it. But honestly, also, I can't eat wings on stream. Wings is not a stream food. You look forward to seeing me? Dude, I always look forward to seeing you, b -san. We joke, but I love having you around in my streams. I just need you to stop making new fake accounts. Keep the ones you have. 
Like, stop making new ones, for the love of God. Please stop. All right, that's my inventory sorted. I love you guys. You guys are amazing. Thank you for another amazing stream. Thank you for all the amazing streams recently. Uh, tomorrow, probably Binding of Isaac, I'm gonna say. Uh, probably doing some Binding of Isaac tomorrow. Maybe doing, like, some Mario ROM hacks into some Binding of Isaac afterwards. Doing some more challenges. And then Friday, we're gonna be drinking some wine and playing some random horror games. Very much looking forward to that this Friday. Uh, so drop the like if you haven't. Subscribe if you haven't. I'll catch you guys next time. You're amazing. Stay awesome. See you guys later, man. Have a wonderful night, guys. You deserve it.